Hello, welcome to the channel. My name is Karsha Goblin. This is Goblin Cave TV, and today we are back with our Rogues and Refugees, our derivative Saints and Sinners game. Um, I'm just, of course, checking how many episodes we have because it's kind of a weird one. We don't play it very often, but it's still really, really fun. This is our casual game, and um, I think we've got about six episodes. This might be the seventh. Again, we don't play this very often. It's been about a month or so since we played it last. Um, this is just for fun, and it's, yeah, it's based off um, Adventurers League, um, the D&D Adventurers League. I do have to say that I'm using D&D Adventurers League content. I'm not an official D&D Adventurers League DM. We're just paying, we're doing as much Adventurers League rules as we can, but we're just having fun with it. So this is not official or anything like that. This is not an official organized game. This is just for us to have some fun um, to muck around with, and it's it's just... It's a, well, it's a casual game. It's probably the best way of putting it. The audio that you listen to in the background is from, um, from Silentscape. They're not a, not a sponsor of the game, also not a sponsor of the channel or the game, etc. But they do amazing stuff, so go check it out. Um, it's silentscape.com for all your online, offline, role-playing needs. Um, you can help out the channel by donating to the players. Um, when you donate, every dollar or per 100 bits um, gives them a D4. Or chat dice, which starts the D4 and goes up D4, D6, D8, D10, D12. Um, and if it goes past D12, it goes to me, the GM, and I get a D20. Usually, this is a um, benefit for the players, but in this game, things are turned a bit more on the head. So that's a penalty dice. So if you're donating to a player, it's to give them a penalty dice. I will assign when it's going to be used. Usually, on a critical roll, um, i.e., an important one. And um, yeah, it gets minus off their roll. So that's how it works. Um, it's it's a bit um, different from normal. So let's go and see our um, cast members today and jump in and go. Hi. Hello, everybody. Hi. What's Hello. up, what's up, what's up? Um, so we've got a little bit different cast today. We've got Lorian joining us for the first time in yep. this. And we've also got Polly playing her first D&D 5th edition right. game. Who knew? Wow. I know. We we just I'm spent the, save yourself. We just spent the last five minutes teaching her the rules. Yeah, right. Well, yeah, and so I'm gonna play like I learned in the last five minutes. So how bad can it go? Um Actually we do the same thing for our um, for our, our Call of Cthulhu games. We spend five minutes in the pre show going through the rules. So um it's kinda weird. <laughs> yeah, we 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 basically hey. I think with it, like with any game, it's like you learn as you go along, really. Yeah, and, yeah well, and, that's what I'm counting on. And if you've played similar games, um, there's going to be a lot of similarities, such as yeah. games like um, Pathfinder, where Pathfinder 2 is a lot of similar to Dungeons & Dragons 5th Edition, although there are a lot of just smaller things which are changed between the two. So you'll be, uh, I'm pretty sure, I'm, pretty, I'm quite confident you'll be able to just run with things. Um, Sweet. Sweet. So, um, <laughs> uh, shall we do our introductions, Miss La Producer? Well, hello, I'm I'm Miss La Producer. I will be playing your Elven Ranger, um, Yella. But considering the rest of my party's not here, I'm not so Yella after all. <laughs> mm. You have to hang with us. <laughs> no? Yeah, the newbies. Oh mm -hmm. God. So, Lady Grace Magistry um, is not going to be here today. And Ruben, the little trickster kid, teenager, punk, um, is also not going to be here today either. I know that sounds like a lot of badness about Ruben, but that's just kind of the character. And Lady Grace Magistry, that's all you need to know about the character. It's mm. totally, she's not a lady. It's an absolutely totally made up name, as obvious as it is. Um, so, Polly. Hey, uh, it's me. <laughs> I'm Polly. Uh, who knew? Here I am. D&D. Uh, today I am playing. So, so I'm going way outside my comfort zone. I'm Romani Camille, the Red Wizard. Uh, we'll try that. With, we'll try this voice for a little bit. See what happens. No. Yeah. Anyway, I'm also known as Polly People. You'll see me in chat. I'll talk to you. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, Lorian. Hi, I'm Lauren Ross, and I'm playing. The dashing roguish individual Theron Byzeros. And this is going to be very, 
Very exciting. Ooh, I can't wait. <laughs> okay, I'm disturbed already. Okay. Oh, oh my. <laughs> oh, oh my. my. <laughs> yes, oh, indeed. Can... That's pretty good. Can I get you to voice act something for me in an upcoming show? I think that's going <laughs> to work. <laughs> Need that character? <laughs> oh my! <laughs> maybe a female version of that voice, maybe. Um, oh my! That's the one. That's the one. Okay. It's bucket. It's okay. It's bucket. <laughs> Don't worry, Polly. It's a new joke. Wa- I can't believe I used to watch <laughs> that. Do they, have, do they fucking funny. have that in Australia as well? Yeah, they yeah, did. yeah. We have Hi, ABC, yeah. which takes all the UK shows from. The ABC in the UK or BBC in the UK. It's a British show. Um, Hyacinth Bucket. Now, um, so just a reminder, our um, um, yeah, our donation system is a little bit reversed, so they are penalty dice, and it's about um, just having fun and embracing failed roles. Um, that was pretty much because our first session we played of this, we had so many critical fumbles that it just became a part of the show. Mm. Um, so last time when we left off, um, our, I, I don't want to call them heroes. Um, Miss Lab, what would you call the party? Rogues? Rogues? Maybe a couple of refugees here and there. Rogues, thieves, under, undesirables, smugglers. Um, it's like another game we play. Well, failed smugglers. Yeah, right. Actually, right. this was the... Um, start of that game. Yeah. <laughs> oh, is that right? <laughs> yes. This was this this started before that game. This was like how it related to the smugglers realm. Um, mm. Our failed smugglers um, went to deliver some artichokes, um, avocados, something to l l They never did quite quite get their paperwork done rightly or their story straight. But um, as they went to deliver it, they were wait. They got to the to the city outside of business hours, so they had to camp outside outside of the city because the walls were closed. That night, under the gleaming sun of the the companion, um, the city disappeared, and um, a big giant crater was left in its place. Um, so they couldn't exactly um, deliver their smuggled goods. So instead. They are the caravan and the escorts of the caravan have decided to band together all the refugees they can and extort them and escort them all the way back to Baldur's Gate. In doing that, they're trying to find bits and pieces, things like getting, um, so things like getting weapons for the trip, where they've had a, they've helped out the local blacksmith and had some running with some cultists. Um, They've also done other things like try to help out the miller by helping the friend or the old man down the road who is a poet who um, wants to watch the world burn and write notes in his diary. And helping that poet, they have collected gum nut seeds, um, uneventfully. Um, They've collected um, high-end paper, the best quality paper, um... Very eventfully, where of course the um, store had a magical catastrophe, magical effect going on, which was quite electronic, uh, quite zappy. Um, and they've also gathered some feathers. And when I say feathers, they were quite ex- quite large feathers. Um, upon return, um, the they were confronted with the sight of. Um, a large beast, large magical beast, banging on the front door, trying to smash it in. I'm not using the name of the beast because um, we have new party members which have also been tasked to get things, um, such as some um, fine toad skin for the binding of this book. And upon uh, upon arrival, they haven't seen this beast because it's around the corner of the building, but they can hear a ruckus going on. They can hear some banging on the no- on the door and banging on the building, but they also hear um, that no, it wasn't me. It was them, as the last thing that was said by the poet as he yells out. And then initiative happened, and we're going to move to the map 
so our new players can finally see exactly what this magical beast is. Oh no! And we can so start with initiative. So they read something horrifying or something really stupid. Would I do either? Yes. Yes. So the yes, thing I is, would. I only have eight hit Pegasus. points. <laughs> a Pegasus. Yes, that is correct. So a Pegasus is the magical beast. A Pegasus also has very large feathers. Right. Which kind of match the feathers which Yella has sticking out his backpack. So we're going to kill a Pegasus? I thought they were nice. Yeah, but we're not. <laughs> All right, fair enough. All yeah, right. Fair enough. <laughs> a Pegasus is going down. <laughs> um, so if you click on your um, token, we've got... Oh, wait, let's get the... Um, turn all up, the on token, and we can have our initiative buttons there. So, ta -da! Okay, so I oh. am not an idiot. I know how to do this. <laughs> I thought you were talking about in character then. Okay. Uh, I am not an idiot. <laughs> idiot. Okay, I don't know if the voice thing's going to work. <laughs> um, oh. We have had different voices okay. be between all the characters because we've had... Upwards of five to six months span between games. So, if you're watching these chronologically on YouTube, that's why everyone <laughs> sounds very, very sense. different. Take a drink every time the voice changes. <clears throat> Three episodes. Oh, later. I, I challenge that notion. I am sticking hard to this. Wow, why did why did I get reminded that of a floating skull? No, there's no whistling. Look how fast that. True, is. no whistling. No. No, um, it's not the subtle whistle of the talking <clears throat> skull. Yeah. Um, so we'll do Ruben and we'll do the other two as well. Although they are, we're not going to put them in danger because that's, that's a... Is that not nice? It's something I would do, but this is a fun campaign. I'm not going to kill people yet. What? Okay, Without yeah, them being like on I'm stream so they can get their um, reaction. Well, that's true. Yes, yeah. it's getting their reaction. You want that's to see the their part. sad faces. When their character dies. Yes, exactly. So you the Pegasus think, yeah. goes first with the initiative of 20. Um, and let's see, can it make that far? I believe it can. It's only 30 feet or 35 feet. And a Pegasus <laughs> can... Yeah, a Pegasus can just bound 30 feet without any issue at all. So yeah. he moves down 40 feet. Oops, there we go. And I think if we're, going to, we're going to attack once at Yellow, once at Reuben. We'll start with Reuben, because Reuben's not here. Good. So I much like for not putting him in already. danger. Um, so does he have one? I think he's only got one attack. So we'll do it over under. Um, high for um, Reuben, low for Yellow. Um, Yellow, it's you. Mm -hmm. And let's go. I'm used to multiple attacks because I'm used to... Second edition Pathfinder at the moment. Um, a nine is a miss, though. As the hooves... It essentially does a couple of steps and then go wingspan over and glides down to where you are. But as it comes down, its front hooves are what's going to land on you first to stop it, and it misses. Um, and that's its go. Hmm. Theron, it is your go. So as I was saying, Rolmani... Hold the phone. Uh, uh, phone. Okay. What on earth is occurring up ahead? This seems what? to be some sort of foul altercation going on. Be with you in a moment, Romani. I must deal with this post haste. Fear not! I, your saviour, Theron, have come to save the day. And I will... You see this individual, this human individual with uh, long shoulder-length ginger hair, a quaffed bardic hat with a feather sticking out the top and a long flowing green swashbuckler coat wander up <clears throat> observe this marksmanship uh, for my bonus action let's see i'm gonna move 30 feet three how far away am i uh, i am 60 feet away what is the range on this i need to i forgot 55 to i hope <laughs> Okay, cheat. I gotta find. Ah, excellent! <laughs> well, technically, it's For my bonus yeah, action, <laughs> I will cast Hunter's Mark on the which, Pegasus. Which has a range of what? 60 feet? 90 feet. Uh -oh. oh, okay. 
<laughs> Lord's. Hunter's Mark on the Pezzo. Okay. Hunter's Mark on the Pegasus. I will knock an arrow in my short bow and fire it. For 24 See, to hit. That's not right. That, that hits. You're not supposed to do that. So 24 to hit. 24 yeah. to hit. 13 <laughs> points of piercing damage. Hopefully Don't think you get like this is not the one for actually exceeding rolls. Okay, thirty points of of damage. Any other actions you've got? You've done moving. You got that's, bonus action. That's got. it. That's my turn. There we go. Um, Polly. It's Ramani, the wet, the red wizard, to the rescue. Here we go. Fair enough, Ramani. Okay. You'll get there eventually. It'll be right behind you, Governor. <laughs> wow, that's a accent change and a half. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, sorry, okay, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Let's see, I gotta be within 60 feet so I can cast my, Just. my spell. Okay, all right, good, good, good. Here comes the Ray of Frost. Nobody has this spell. This is a very special spell. Yes, from the Red Wizard. Yeah, from the, it's, it's a Red Ray of Frost. Now I gotta figure out how to the cast it. The Colorblind Wizard. Pressing the button. Um, give me one second here, uh, folks. Oh, I see. Here's the button. You make it sound so simple, but it's not. There's yeah, a lot of I know. It's which button. Uh, and nine is not going to hit as the frost, oh. the ray of red frost, red tinted frost, flies yeah. out and does nothing. Oh, I'm going to have to uh, get. I'm going to have to work on that. I'll do better next time. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Yella, it's your go. Oh. I so, want to get, I so want to yell out so many expl explicit, <clears throat> explicit swear words at the bugger. Gah. I was going to say, can I do like an animal handling check to say it's not me, it was him? You can. Persuasion? What would you, what would you say? How would I do this? No, I'll do animal handling with disadvantage because it's already attacking you. Okay. Um, I would also put it with disadvantage because you got a feather of his stinging out in your backpack. I would just say, he sent us to get him, it's not us, it's him. You still have his feather, so it's still disadvantage. That's so, right. you do your roll twice and you pick the worst. Nope! Natural one. Welcome to Rogue okay. Refugees, everybody. Hey, there we go. <laughs> there we go. So, you go, here's the one... He did it, not me, and as you're pointing, that feather is like sticking right out, right underneath its nose. Yeah. I'll take that. I don't think, I don't think it works. Um, as Ruben sees that and takes, his, takes that as an advantage of time to run, disengages and just break, bolts out and off the map mm -hmm. into yeah. hiding somewhere. As you've seen him do, away from the party before. Lady Grace says, um, Yellow, um, you, you, you deal with that. I'm, I'm going to go, I'm going to chase and, and make sure the kid's okay as she runs off and off the map. Uh, we got good friends in high places here. Uh -huh. that's, that's... More like cowards in very low places, if you ask me. That's actually kind of behavior what they would do. Yes. Um, yeah, that's yes. fine. Cool. This gum. Okay, so we're back to Theron. Right. Ever advancing, I shall step forward another 30 feet, knock my arrow once again, and fire. Still have Hunter's Mark. A 13. Yeah, look at all those dice. A 13 is a hit, unfortunately. 12 mm. points of damage. You know, I've always fancied a few Pegasus feathers for my arrows. <laughs> um, so that's that. You've got. You still have a bonus action unless you want to do anything else uh, with nope. it. Uh, leave I've it on. I'll leave it. I don't have cunning action yet because that's level two. Yeah, that's <laughs> not going to happen. You know my idea about low-level characters. Um, mm. Polly. You don't have character okay. plot armor yet, so. 
I consider moving up for closer to be brave and fight, but I thought, you know what? I like that chap up there already. He's he's willing to uh, to to be the brave one. I'll just stay back here. Um, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna cast Ray of Frost again because okay. it works. Well, I think it, I think sometimes. it'll work. It'll work sometimes. Nate needs a hit this time. That's something, right? Yeah. Boom. Oops. Oh. And something fell. That was the power of the Ray of Frost. It bounced back into my, into my, into my uh, study here. Okay. So you do damage. It's got little icicles on the edge of, of, of its feathers, of its wings, and it, it yelps with pain. But it is now yell as go. Uh, well, as an action, I would like to disengage. Hopefully, can I do that. Are you going to abandon these new adventurers? That could be a very short session. I, I am, fine. I'm just going to go. I would go say disengaged about here, so to here, and run around trying to drag the Pegasus back to the other guy. If he's following me for the feather, I'm going to lead him up that way. It's getting to fifth edition. You can go around the yeah, but I was and then face. disengage from that side. Yeah. <laughs> so I have 35 movement. That's one, two, three, four. That's twenty. And then you can do your disengage, and then do your yep. the rest of the movement. So disengage here. So I thought you were running away. Oh, That's no, not very chivalrous. No, I'm I'm moving up this way. Okay. And if you disengage, it doesn't have an attack of yep. opportunity. If you use one of your actions. Yes, that. and that's my turn. And that's your turn. Um, those two are off the map, essentially speaking, and the Pegasuses go. Let's do a 50-50 here. Um, high is Theron, low is Yellow. <sighs> yep, Yellow, you're not having a good day. No, I'm not. Yeah. As it I feel like this big does it... target on my back. Well, it's not just, it's not a target on your back, it's feathers sprouting out of your backpack. Yeah. That's the target. So, it's feathers, you know? as it does a leap and and the wings spread out to glide and then comes down onto your back well this attempts to how let's go yeah no no two threes <laughs> that's not gonna happen no. um again tries to attack but does very little um, Can we just make it that the feather gets on the nose that's there's all sneeze and misses? If you'd like that, then okay. I would like that. Okay. Um, back to Theron. Leave that elf alone, you monster! And I will run up, uh, sheathing my short bow, drawing a short sword and a dagger, and I will attack once. With a 11. Right, you're sheathing and you're drawing two weapons. Can I? Oh, yeah, that's right. I can't draw you, two. I, I can't. I'll just draw one weapon then. So I'll you're dropping my, one. Dropping the bow. Can I put my bow away and then draw? That's, that's the same thing as drawing. I think it, that's. Starfinder is restricted like that, but 5e, I think you're allowed it's to an, do that. It's an interaction. That's why, that's why you drop weapons and move on. All right, yeah, I'll drop the bow. Okay. Drop the bow, draw one weapon okay. as a part of your move, yep. And you do your short sword attack, which I think is finally... Yes, it's finally a miss. Yes. Welcome hey. to the campaign. Um, <laughs> Blasted fiend. Uh, Romani, fetch my bow when you have the chance. Would you kindly thank you? I got it. I got it. But I'm going to do something here first. I'm, a, I'm the red wizard. You see, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this, I'm gonna put this Pegasus to sleep. So I, I, I wave my hands around. I draw my ring. I, I can't find it. That's okay. I'm going to cast sleep. So you wave your hands around. You get your, your pocket watch. Oh, right. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah. And. You're feeling sleepy. Sleepy. You're a tired, tired horse. 
What? All my slots expended? That's bullshit. Yeah. I only did once. Welcome to D&D. What? D &D. what? So you, have, you should have two. You should have two. Yeah, right. Yeah. Rare Frost at the start and then sleep. No, Rare Frost is no, a cantrip. No, Rare Frost is a cantrip. Yeah. Oh. Really? Weak. Well, I only have two t spell slots? Yeah. At level one, yeah. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> well, this horse better be asleep because that was that was half my... Half, is there any really save for that? Hey, no, if 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 they have that much HP or lower, they fall asleep. If it's above that, they're awake. Doesn't work. Twenty-seven hit points. That horse is is tired. It's a tired horse. I'm very sorry. Very sorry. Well, it's not that, but it's that. <laughs> it just flops to the ground. The red wizard has arrived. Thank you very excellent, much. Excellent, excellent work, Romani. I <laughs> knew you had it in you. Yeah, you know, I'm real tired, though. I probably only have one of those left in me. Max. This, will be, this should be swift now. Well, what do you do with the unconscious Pegasus? Search the body. Are we Are we still Are we still on initiative? I well, what would you here. like to do? I'd like to go for a coup de gras. <laughs> oh, good idea. That's right. That's in this game. Yeah. Uh, it's not, but technically no, but... Are we poachers? I attack with advantage, and if I hit, it's an auto crit. <laughs> so it's essentially a coup de grace. So, so nice I, will draw, I will draw my dagger, and I will stab with my short sword. 15 to hit. That's a crit? That's a crit. Wow! Because, because it's, it's, an auto crit, it's an auto crit because the Pegasus is unconscious. I don't know why so it's done that, but okay. Double crit. Because I, I just changed it to be an auto crit. Oh, I didn't know you could. Do that. Okay. I just I just changed it so it says crit range because you can put oh, it nineteen. Okay. <laughs> so I just put it I just put it to one. I've never seen that done, but yes, that works. Yes. Um, so that's what twenty. Twenty one. Twenty one. Twenty six. Twenty nine points of damage at level one. Plus hunter's mark as well. Uh, and speaking. then. And then I will offhand with my dagger. I think it's awake now, right? Um, no, it's not. It's not awake? Is it dead? No. Yes. Okay. It has to be under 27 hit points to go oh, sleepy sleepy. Oh, yeah. That's, that's good. I, I, that was, that's my, that's my uh, failure to do math. <laughs> uh, as, as you do that, you see the door opening. And um, the old man... We'll just turn the, the combat movie... The old man. In that case, I will bonus action move my hunter's mark to the old man. <laughs> comes out. <laughs> come, yes, come, comes you. out with a with a mallet, a wooden mallet. Just. Ah! Um. I, 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 and he's pointing to the to the Pegasus. Is it dead? It's. Oh, it's not going to kill us. I Yellow's it. going to run up and yeah. pick him up by the scruff of the neck. Like pick the man up. Pick the old pick the old man up. Okay. I got I will Go ahead. I will pluck a feather from a wing and put it in my hat. Ooh. It's a big giant feather. It's yeah, I have big, a big giant, giant feather in my hat. <laughs> you also notice that um the the elf fight like that you were fighting with um, has multiple of the feathers in his sticking out of his oh. backpack. I'm sure that's probably what pissed it off in the first place, but he can keep them. I have plenty of them to choose from. I, uh, I, I can go for I can go for one of the smaller ones, like the downy ones, like the insidey ones. That'd be <laughs> better because a large feather in the hat is quite cumbersome. So I'm going to try and find a smaller one. Did you mean a bit ostentatious? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Pleasure I like to, it. Pleasure to meet you. My name's Theron. Pleasure to meet you. My name's Yeda. I'm going to go there, kill this person now. Excuse there me. There is I, I, I didn't do anything. Look, you, it, you, did you... Hey, yeah, no. Did, did that you, violence, hey, no. Did, did no. you deserve it? Did you deserve it? I'm, of course not. I'm familiar with... Are you sure? He sent us... Oh, sorry. He sent us to get feathers, paper, ink... Frog skin? That was a pain in the butt. Well, oh, uh, you too, you too, huh? Well, I've got to have something nice for the journal. We've got to make a, a new journal for the travel. Backhand slap. Ow! 
Look, it's very good to meet you. You are going to th- you are going to throw me to the pe- to the Pegasus for stuff that you've wanted. I didn't Back throw anything. Backs up again. Uh, so I'm the Red Wizard. I was the one who felled this creature for you. Uh, we 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 are now. We would appreciate a little bit of compensation as per the yes, deal. Yes, of course. Of course. Uh, here we no are. No good deed goes unpunished, as they say. Oh, uh, right. Or... Well, you're doing this so I could... Well, they were doing sometimes. that so I could join their their caravan. And they did three things. You did only one. So... Or Can maybe two him? now. Whack him across we the saved head. your life, sir. My mother gave me life. And I just prov- and I just gave you an escape from death. So uh, I will I will move my hunter's mark over to him. <laughs> Can I cast a like a like burning hands on him? <laughs> Something that does damage. That's Here. that's your other level one spell slot. Okay, yeah, okay, I can't your, use it on him. Other. So so look look. Do you see these fingers? Do you see what they do? You don't want to mess with us. We don't want to mess with you. We're just I have, I have I'll nothing. Start, I'll start. I'll start juggling my weapons. Look, I, I mean, look at that. Did you see that? That's that. That that is not free right there. I mean, yeah, it looks over the fair. Look at it. Weird. And there's a little not too bad. Impressive. Hey, we're <laughs> weird. We got the job done. We're here. We took. We're we're the Pegasus Busters. That's what the you call the specialists. We came in, we did our thing. Now what? You're going to stiff us? Look, I didn't... I have nothing. I don't have money. I was, like... <laughs> I was asking for a few things before we hit the road and before we go on to our wagon training. Co- because you're such an you don't, you don't have liquidated money. I'm sure you have plenty of assets. Too true. Well, too true. Listen, listen to You him. can have my house, then. Marvellous. <laughs> yeah, all right. Well... I knew we could come to an understanding. Could I could I get that in Hi. writing? <laughs> I don't think it's going to last very long with all the um all the things coming out of that hole over there. That's a good point. Um But thank you, you you accepted, so I'm I'll t- I'll take I'm I'll take your hook. clothing instead. I mean I, I need my clothing. Well you wouldn't have needed it if you were dead. Yes, but I don't need the house, and you said you accepted the house, so it's already done. My dear, I'll just have it do you honestly for you. think? Do you honestly think you're in a position to bargain right now? You sent us on some loathsome errand in the middle of God knows where, when there is, quite frankly, a disaster occurring just over the horizon, and now you are expecting us to just walk along after having saved your life for no compensation. I mean, really, man. What kind of climate do you take this for? I mean, you hear that fancy talk? You got to do what he says. I mean, I, and a, a I climate would've... of goodness and honesty and having goodwill to <laughs> all other men and women. My my dear sir, Alterel has fallen. The city no longer exists. Whatever goodness and honesty was in this world is long gone. So I'd, li- I'd buckle up and brace yourself for the new world order. That is oh, chaos. I was quite happy to sit on Lovely my... Lovely chaos. So, I was quite happy to sit on my porch, but these individuals, these people, um, wanted me to come with them and join them in their expedition back to, well, down to Boulder's Gate of all places. And so I asked them, well, they they were dragging me there. Oh, why didn't you say so? Oh, no, it's fine. Don't worry about that. You'll be. (laughs) My goodness, you should have just opened with that line, honestly. Well, it was actually. Physically confused now. Yeah, me too. You're still but... pissed at this guy. Can oh, you put me down? For him, it, for him no. it so, but I don't know. Anyone who's heading to Baldur's Gate, he'll get what's coming. <laughs> yeah, uh, Sounds like a terrible point. place, but, you know. Oh, it's wonderful. Yeah. <laughs> For a given value, wonderful. Yes. Can you can you put me down? No. You are coming with me. Well, that was the idea, but I. You know, I was going to get your paper after a while. without Listen. your ink, without yes. your quill. You're going as is. Raw. Before before we hastily move on, raw Pegasus material 
fetches a rather high price. This could be a lucrative cash cow. So yes. I'm going to. Uh, you, I came out. I, I will. I will remove my coat, gently hand it to Romani, and begin to carve up this Pegasus. Excellent. I see. I've joined the right crew here. Oh, and yellow, yellow is during this point with has... in one hand is pretty much busily hog tying him. <laughs> He's pissed. Um, if you have any open. skill in um, in survival for skinning, you can just do it. You can start. Uh, I've been. I I've got. I've got a. Where, where's my survival? It's probably. I got a one, but I've also got a good sleight of hand, so I don't know. I've got survival of four. Yeah. If you want to take care of him, I can do the skinning. All right. Very well. Very well. You're in the pelt. Yeah. You will take care of him. Hog tie him and do whatever if you want to him. Including, right, okay. a, including a gag, if possible. I don't want to hear him anymore. Sorry, Romani. Can I have my coat back? Thank you. Oh, wait. Well, sure, 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 sure. Yeah. Um, so, so, uh, Darren yeah, comes your, over, worst. I will pass the old man to Darren and says, yeah, just make sure he doesn't say anything. He gets on my nerves. So it's, it's... I, I, as you walk I, up, I, he, I, he I, tries I, to I, reach I will, for a feather yeah, no, from your backpack. I, I, will, I will grasp him by the chin like this and just bring him up. Hello, darling. You've made some poor life decisions. <laughs> I, I was happy sitting on the porch until these uh, sh- people came. Sh- 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 the time for talking is over. <laughs> and I was just... <laughs> I, will, I will let Yellow get on with skinning. And I, yeah. I will just never break... I will just keep him there in, in silence. Very awkwardly. <laughs> <laughs> he, he tries talking a couple more times, but he just... Feels uncomfortable I, every time. He's I, like, every time I'm just like, every time I'm just like, Shh, yeah. no, 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 no. Um, so if anyone's actually got um, goodness in their character, you feel uncomfortable about all this, but I don't think anyone does. So have fun skinning a celestial creature. Bitch, this yeah. campaign is called Rogues and Refugees. <laughs> <laughs> At least the other one has saints as well as sinners. This is this is. Oh, there's no saints in that campaign. Um, all the saints of the NPCs. Um, I'm going to say, technically, um, Ave is probably the closest you've got to a saint. True. Which is very, very scary. True. True. Um, but yeah, so... Uh, after a while, um, Lady Grace, Magistry, uh, um, comes back with a... Well, it looks to be a um, um, teenager. Um, a little bit dishevelled, both of them... Well, Lady Grace is not like he's all preened and proper, and um, looks like she's just um, spent an hour um, preening herself. Um, but the the child looks like he's got um, um, how can I put it? Um, sorry, the ch- the the teenager has leaves on him, um, like looks like he's been running through bushes um, quite a bit, like quite a few bushes. And yet Lady Grace um, is totally prim and proper and, like, perfectly clean. And they come back and it's like, um, so everything's good? Marvellous, thank you. Yep. Ship shape out here. We are going, to, we're going to send him to the caravan without his ink, without his paper, without his quills. And without his can... supper. But we're leaving, a little him, hungry. we're leaving him his clothing, though. Do you really want to see that thing as daddy air? <laughs> I don't know. Depends. Is he an old man? Yes. He's middle-aged. No. 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 Uh, he gets nothing. He's, he's fine. Okay. He's fine. Um, he was going to sell us out to this Pegasus, who, due to the thanks of these new people... Sorry. I'm aping... Accents. I do apologize. <laughs> Listen to me. Yeah. So, so, um, place, so all right. Yeah. <clears throat> it's all right, Gavna. The Red Wizard here today. Um, you're, you're, so... you're lucky. I have no. You're lucky. I have no pride in being from Britain. Oh God, no. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I was hoping um, to actually get him as a mount, but no. Wait, you gonna train what? The Pegasus of the Mount or the old man? 
No, not that pig. kind. We're not that kind of role playing. <laughs> I just but, didn't know if you're playing goblins. I just, we've had that oh, before. Oh, yeah, good point. No, yeah, that, that's all. So you butcher the Pegasus. You get yes. it's mostly feathers. You can get meat if you'd like. You can get teeth and hooves. As like in my character sheet, I've just put blood. Pegasus materials. How many? <laughs> how many? And um, blood. Yeah. Fine ivory. It is, it, and the horn. The, for me, the yeah. most important is the horn. Uh, yeah, well, uh, I that's, 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 that's a, unicorn. a unicorn. I'm thinking of an olive. I'm thinking of a something. Oh, see, yeah. yeah. I thought I saw a horn. I must have. No, Pegasus I'm fly. I got my eyes checked. Yeah. Unicorns oh. have the horn. They teleport. I was, I was I'm not so interested unicorn. in it now. You guys can have it. I thought although, it was feathers. Although, Thavians have black uniform, black unicorn cavalry. Um, mm. Which teleport at will so they charge into battle teleport and the cavalry riders if they didn't treat them right are flung into battle without a unicorn underneath them um treat your mounts well mm. uh, there we go so um the the butchering is dealt with you can get unicorn supply oh sorry pegasus supplies <laughs> it's probably the, the nicest Pegasus bits. I just um, put Pegasus materials. Yeah. You know, you know uh, the rump steak, uh, a, unico- a, a Pegasus rump steak is to die for. Oh. You know, I'm willing to try any part of it. Well, okay. Not any. But. <laughs> I mean, awful I can give or take if I'm desperate, but no, a nice juicy rump. All right. Well, let me let me cast fire. Let's get this going. There. Are you going to eat it here, or are you going to go back to camp? Oh, please! Let's not be so barbaric. We need we need something to seize it. True. We can't just yeah. have burnt. We're classy. Meat. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. We're we're a classy yeah. bunch. Let's do this right. Speaking of which, I believe proper introductions are in order. Um, Theron, I keep forgetting what I put for his surname. <laughs> Bezeros. <laughs> Theron Bezeros. It Pleasure is so to make good your to meet you. And I will. Oh, a, a gentleman. Well, hello. I am real. I, I gotta look at my character sheet too. I'm Romani Camille, the Red Wizard of Red Town. Can- Red Lodge. <laughs> Red Lock. Oh, right, right. I forgot. I that's you're right. You're right. Which is a throwback yeah. to Prince of yeah. the Apocalypse. Yeah, that's um, that, that's my hometown. Can can I just get a history? Check from anyone except for Polly. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. I'm not so good at this either. Oh. Or Arcane, if you've oh, got it. Ignore the uh, 13. Um, arcane. I Do I have Arcane? I don't have Arcane. If, yeah. Um, so, Red Wizards are a thing. Um, oh, you, yeah. can't remember, you can't remember why they're a thing, but you, you kind of remember that they're a thing. And there's something about them that you should remember. Is it like a? Is it like a fucking murder cult or something? <laughs> You're just like I'm a red wizard. <laughs> uh, yeah. Usually, I I, I, I I wait to tell people that later, but you know, I felt close to you right off the bat, so I thought I'd come clean. Um, a, male or female character? Female. Okay. Um, hairstyle. Uh, well. Long and ratty, but I have a pointy red hat. Okay. Of course. And I have a shirt that looks just like this shirt. <gasps> I know, Cosplay. Right? Yeah. Yeah. T- turns out. Yeah. Um, so as you, as you head off, um, you do remember that you have to call into the mill, um, which is oh, why no. you were down here. Yeah. We've picked up Yella. Oh, no. Yella has taken the reins of the old man. Old man's got a ball a, a gag in his mouth, so he can't. Ball gag. <laughs> you just produce a ball gag. A piece of meat from the cuttings. Well, I do technically have an abacus. I can always take the abacus apart, take a ball out of the abacus, and <laughs> throw. Um, we can use, we can use one of the Pegasus' as kidneys. <laughs> <laughs> no. I'm evil, not that evil. Yeah. So. You head off down, um, you do have to stop into the mill. So mm. Ippon and um, the, ha- the female halfling, Ippon, um, and her partner, um, Pal, um, 
have finished loading up the wagon or the cart full of their produce, full of their flour, um, to help feed the um, to help feed the um, caravan, and um, they see the blood-stained sacks <laughs> and feathers <laughs> from from the Pegasus, and they go, "Have you been hunting?" Um, yes, yes, we found dude, a, a right, rather yeah. delicious um, deer, which will. <laughs> Provide us with ample nourishment for the day's travel. For the, for the entire journey should Every be Every dear. Well, we've got a hand cart if that helps. Um, we weren't going to bring it with us. We were going to abandon us. But oh, no. If that helps you carry. Yeah, hand Yeah, why not, right? It's a bit wicked, but it'll at least make us down to... Um, it'll make it down to camp at least. Um, have you got everything? Um, is there a reason why um, Bilpin isn't... A little bit tied up. Oh, yeah. He just dis- he he disappointed us. Yeah, yeah. yeah there's this look between the two, and they they don't you. They, there's no there's spoken it, word. There's, but this there's, con- there's this just constant, almost unnerving, like charming smile. Just like <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but their faces are whiter, visibly whiter. Um, it could be from the flower, um, but you, you just think that their faces are a little, just a paler as they load up the like they uh, no they worry. finish loading up and head down the hill to the countryside, or kind of countryside around the city, and to the base camp. Um, a few hours out of the city by now, um, just off a main road. Um, as you, as you're going down to the base camp, you do see what looks to be other large caravans being organised. Um, from vantage points, you can see from time to time, you can see other main like large caravans being organised um, independently of your own. And um, it looks like this is something that's happening um, as a more constant thing. Your group seems to be one of the larger groups, but. It's hard to tell from the small bits of vantage that you get, um, or going through the country, or going through the forest and countryside and whatnot and woods. Um, so, as you um, head back to base camp, I've got to find the people's names. Cause that's the kind of thing. Um, uh, Dara. I think Dara sounds right. Yeah, I <laughs> open up the thing. It's da- hand out. Dara. 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 Yes. Dara. Yes. Fucking Dara O'Brien. Um, so you see there's a, the, you've got like the, the caravan has gathered more people over time. Um, and even today has gathered more people. It's late in the day. Um, and Dao is, is busy organizing people, um, and just getting things sorted. You see again, the, the table with just a stash of weapons that people are freely able to pick up and hand out. And thank you, Neuro, for punishing Polly. Um, <laughs> Yeah. So the first negative is going to be D four for Polly. I will choose when it's being used. Um, But I want it to be really bad because my character is a shithead. Oh no, that's 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 me being really bad. So yeah, (laughs) it it will be like that. I love Um, the intonation of that. (laughs) that There There you go. So thank you for the redemption. (laughs) Um. So. Again, there's like the, the it's like an open cart, almost a table where there's just weapons laying out there, and you see a few people having like two handed mallets walking around with them. They don't look like they have any idea about what they do or how to use them. And there's sort of daggers and there's um, sharpened um, sharpened pins that people have on their belts. Um, not really organised, but at least some protection. Um, and then there's like, what else did we get? We've got, um, I'm trying to think what else we got. No, I think that's about it. Um, the flower gets unloaded and starts getting moved around and organized. Dara comes to you and goes, ah, oh, thank God we're getting close to finishing, getting close to moving off. I think we'll have another day um, spent organizing and then we're going to head off um, probably at the end of tomorrow and um, if we get everything right. Um, get yourself sorted, have a night's rest. Um, 
and she turns to Lady Grace and the and um I'm trying to think um Lady Grace and um Reuben says I might have a job for you tonight um come see me after you've eaten um I think we've got something that you could do quite well um but come see me after you've eaten and she just walks off and starts reorganizing other bits and pieces um so Bye. there's there's a lot of people now about 30 people in this increasingly large campsite oh, um, um by completely off on topic off topic yellow is pretty much hogtied make sure he's hogtied and is chucked in the back she of doesn't the, question it back of the thing and just dealt with i don't she, give a monkeys about him anymore she doesn't Good question people. it she absolutely does not question it uh, it's Good just people. your heroes have arrived back with mm. with this mm. bounty we are now prepared mm. to accept tribute the the tribute part um what? is a bit of a what but the um the good heroes and what like the good people the the start got people's attention and then it went downhill oh. um especially when you're asking for money well, at least up front i got to phrase this better next time good yeah. people please partake of our bounty we will bill you later that's how kind we are Diplomacy with disadvantage. All right, all right. Before I, 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 I believe, if, if I may, good people, we your heroes provided a fine bounty. You are forever in our debt. <laughs> um, you can do diplomacy without advantage, but I'm putting that D4 onto that because that's Polly's. <laughs> Where's my uh No no Lloyd's Lloyd's oh. taken over the diplomacy. Pers persua persuasion? Persuasion. Oh no, no, no. Don't listen to him, good people. What I said. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Holy hell. <laughs> <laughs> that's persuasion we're rolling. Alright, I'll do that. Um They all agree. That's a bit better. No, but the I said my, I was doing that minus out. four onto you. I mean, it's a natural one. Um, so Based that 19 is actually 15. Um, Still a pass. It's, well, you don't know the level of things, because you did have twice you're talking about charging them, which kind of gives you that negative context already. And yeah. then you've also, yeah. All right. All right. It's so a the, tough crowd. That's a tough crowd. You get a lot of grumbling from the crowd and a lot of, like, well, I thought well, I thought we we're going to be leaving with them um, tonight. Like now we have to stay night, and now they're going to charge us another night for food. What's this guy? And there's this grumbling, starting to. There's this. You just sparked discontent. Well people done. Have no sense of, people have no sense of humor. Honestly, I'm going to cast sleep on everybody. Well Is done. It? You just sparked discontent. Uh, um, you're going to cast uh, sleep on everybody now. Yeah. And then murder them all. Time for them to go to sleep. Well. Let's see if some of them try to try to see things our way. Don't worry. Don't worry. They have to sleep sometime. We don't have to put them to sleep, and that's when they'll pay us. <laughs> I mean, I've had it. You know. This is not a good group. It's not. Oh, my goodness. Good only gets you killed, unfortunately. Yeah. It's the way of the world. That's the way well, I've... Good is Eltero, and Eltero has disappeared. That's Precisely. what happens for good. Precisely. If there's ever any morals to be learned from the gods, then it is. If you are good, then you are going to get the shit kicked out of you. Yellow <laughs> nods. <laughs> Gestures to the um to the old man. The thing gives a kick. I mean, just look at that Pegasus. I mean, I mean the deer. The deer. The deer. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. yeah right. Well, well. Dinner though is spectacular. Who says they get any of that? That's that's like five no, gold for the group. that shit. Oh, for the group, a for us, yeah. I don't assume you're you're handing it out. They can have the flour and make some like rough breads. Yeah, I mean, it's a giant nice. horse. We could we could we could spare the like the 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 terrible parts. I mean, let's let's. The thing is, the thing is, you do want to be somewhat generous because you know they 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 could turn on us, and I'd rather not kill them. We so. have excellent Pegasus brains to share with all of you. 
<laughs> if there are any elephants in the crowd, speak up now. <laughs> no, I guess not. No response from that one, except for murmurs. And again, the, there is this discontent. I don't uh, think they know what elephants are. Yeah, I, I, again, no I don't get these of, people. No sense of humor, honestly. So, in the morning. Um, oh, healing. Yeah, let's, Oh, healing? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You, you really need healing, do you? Are you sure? I did. I need. I was at nine. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you. Thank you, Nero Croc. Um, mm -hmm. So the D4 is now to yellow. No, I thought you um, D4. Oh, so you'd use D4. That's the new D4. At least it's not a yeah, D4. Yeah, I, I, no. I used it on the, I used it on the, uh, on the one oh, to make it even worse be because now. you now have discontent. Oh. There's now an, an overwhelming discontent across the... And that's going to stay there until something else is done. I mean, we're used to that. I, well, I'm used to that. For some reason, I don't know what it is. It seems like people get all pissed off when I'm around. They're just they're haters. Look, people I'm hate. just trying to inject some levity in the situation. But people are just so dour. Honestly. As, as you're saying that, you're walking past a group of people and you see, like, a family um, in, in a huddle around a campfire. Um, they're, they're having like their gruel, like their gruel, like their soup or whatnot. Um, you know, like you don't notice that one of them only has one arm and like you've got claw marks to there and then there's nothing else from that. Look, have you ever seen And the child is just weeping underneath. <laughs> I mean, honestly, have you ever seen people more in need of cheering up? <sighs> There's something. You know what? I'm in need of cheering up. Are they asleep yet? When are they so long asleep? Is this family they, asleep yet? They will fall asleep at night time. Uh, what are you going to do when they fall asleep? Or do I just pass them to, to the day? No, no. I'm going to try to... I need to live. I'm, I'm the red wizard. I'm far from home. And like all red wizards, I have to, I have to raise money for my, for my future and my my continued education and so i pick their pockets this will be marvelous i, okay. I say nothing and i just yeah. observe um are you going tent to tent or are you going to like merchants who where, can, where are you looking who at? can i tell has the most money or the most the most stuff um you know the most most money is certainly going to be um the 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 caravan itself the core caravan group but you also know they're going to be handing you that money. Like they're charging people to do to come on to this to join the caravan. And that's going to us anyway. Yes. Okay, so I don't care about that. So I'm just making sure if you're going to steal from your own pocket. No, um, no, if you're no, not no, stealing no. from your own that. pocket. No, no. I'm not Most that people smart. don't have anything. That Most people oh, don't have anything. Mainly for the case of they're being charged so much to come <clears> onto the caravan. And being charged for protection and being f and feed and stuff like that. All right. Well, it seems like we've already done a good enough job robbing these people. I'm going to bed. Don't you just love capitalism? Mom? I do, actually. It's legal, f legal, fair, and we get the same money. Yeah. Supply and demand. And so in the morning, um, a couple of your party members are not there. When asked, Dara says that um, I sent them out to sow discontent among the other caravans to see if we can get some more people um, right. before we leave tonight. I like um, your style. Sh shouldn't be too hard. Um, Lady Magistry um, is going to enter the enter the enter their groups um, with her child Reuben and just um, spark some discontent and chaos, which I think she'll be able to do quite well with Reuben. Um, but we do have one last one last thing before we go. Um, there seems to be a bit of discontent among the um, people traveling with us, and we might need to um, change that over the course of over the course of the several weeks of journey. Um, mm -hmm. There's a um, tavern um, which we believe might be abandoned, and we might be able to get some um, um, yeah, some alcohol. You know, I love a to wild fight in a tavern. Um, and idea. if it's and if it's not about raising the spirits, it will keep people dull. If you can't um, raise the spirits, imbibe spirits. Yes, and means that they aren't Too going true. to revolt as much. Um, and if they do revolt, 
Or if they do have discontent, we can always explain that they walked off a cliff by being drunk, um, if need be. I like the way you think. For the ringleaders, of course. Um, not for everybody. Um, children don't drink, unfortunately. You don't have to call us ringleaders. That makes us sound so bad. No, no, no. I mean, the ringleaders, the, the ringleaders that um, may be against us, that may be oh, so in discontent yeah. already. Oh, True. Right. They are ringleaders. That's right. Yes, That's organizing people against us. Okay. They might end up a bit more drunk and disappearing, i.e. walking off a cliff or walking into the forest. Mayhaps. Mayhaps. That's just my thought. Um, I hope it doesn't come to that, but... Yeah, it's, it's planning ahead. But um, yes, we've, there's a tavern. Um, if it's got occupants, again, try to work with them, try to get them along, try to get them willingly to help us. It does help us look good. Um... And they, they, they spread the word, etc. And um, but if not, um, just if it's empty, just take what you can. Um, but otherwise, um, yes. And she gives directions and gives instructions, etc., of where it's going to be. Um, off into right, the outer city. Right to the pub, then I suppose. Yalla, will you to be the joining pub. us? Well, looks like the. Looks like the rest of my team's gone, so I'm going to do something. So, you're lumped Hello. with us, it seems. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. So much uh. fun. Oh, it will be. Trust me. If there's anything you can put, count on me, is I will endeavor to make things as fun as possible. And we're going to take a break, and then we're going to be um, have the arrival ah. at the pub. Ooh, yeah. And if you, think, wait. if you think we're going to do. Um, um, tavern music in the background? Yeah, no, that's not going to be how it works here. So we'll be back shortly. Um, enjoy the sounds of the soundscape, and um, we'll be back really soon. I really want to use that D4 against um, MLP. Yeah. <laughs> See you in a bit. Bye. 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 Hello, welcome back. Um, hey, we are back hi, for hi. part two of our... I don't even know the episode name. That's really bad. Um, don't Unicorn even know the episode Pegasus number. Pegasus materials. Pegasus awful? Um, shit eating grin. <laughs> <laughs> Pe no, Pegasus eating grin. There you go. Um, we're actually fifth. We're actually the fifth episode. I'm just checking up now. Um, last last episode was no morals roleplay. Um, Fe feather in the cap. Oh, oh, there we one. go. That's a good one. All right. Red, red, fe red feathers. Red feathers. Oh. Red. Let, let's wait. Here? Let's wait till we actually see the second part of the episode. Yeah. That's true. About that's a true. name, because that's true. things are going to get weird. Okay. That's why I'm not I'm doing. Because you're going to the pub. Oh yes. yeah. Good fight in a tavern. I love that. I, I cannot wait to siphon alcohol. <laughs> oh wait. Now it's my turn to make sure all alcohol is banned and, and tastes like vinegar and you can't use it. I'm kidding. Hey. <laughs> I'm not petty having an alcoholic character that can't have hey. alcohol. Hey, there, there is a place <laughs> you can go called Mahadi's Wandering Emporium. I know. <laughs> and you can drink all your life. I know. I, I just like, damn. Yeah. And you gave me inspiration for... Uh, being annoyed that I can't drink alcohol. Like, <laughs> so Is this evil. from the Saints and Sinners? That's Saints yeah. and Sinners, yeah. yeah. Okay. I've got an alcoholic basically, character. Basically, the, the plains of Avernus taint food and drink, so they are disgusting. Nourishing, yeah. but disgusting. Oh, wow. So your character is like having withdrawal and shit. Yeah. 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 <laughs> like, he, he's drank himself into a sewer and kept on going further down, and now he ends up in hell where he can't drink. So. Yeah. Well, truly, it is hell for your character. Yeah. I've already noted that. I've already, already noted that. Yeah. <laughs> Just to reiterate the point. Oh, boy. Um, what am I doing? I'm doing something. I've, I, there we go. But, well, that's, that's one great thing about running a, a, the Avernus campaign, is I've, got to, I've been able to curate each character's personal hell. Yeah, thanks. It's, it's, oh, it's, it's not appreciated. <laughs> Although, I'm semi-being lucky in the last couple of things, but I think just knowledge 
about what's happening with my character and what's going on there is enough help for me. Yeah, just just not appreciated. Um. No. <laughs> I don't know. Like. Yeah. Yep. Okay. So you're off in the morning. You head out into again the outskirts of Eltrell. The dis the um. It's like a um, um, dispersed township that circles the what was the city of Eltrell. Now a hole in the ground with um, monsters flying out of every now and then. Um, so you're heading to the fabled Fawn Inn in the outskirts, and as you approach, the, there's no issues getting to the inn. There's no bits I've and heard pieces. Good things about this place. It's, it's all calm and quiet. Um, I'll even give you a handout, a rare handout that we have. Ooh. Yeah. I'll show it to players. I uh, did the map whole thing. Well, it looks and, so inviting ooh. and cozy. Yeah. So, the cozy little favorite form. Yeah. Hotel. All right. Um. And I should. Have, well, I've got to bring that back up again. Um, about money. It's always about money with you people. I just like yes. Hey. Makes the world so, go as you make your way up to as you make your way up to the road, um, you spot fiendish creatures hammering at the inn's front door. Thick black smoke rises from the nearby barn, which has been set ablaze. Voices can be heard inside the inn, shouting and cursing at the encroaching devils. As you watch the devils smash open and charge into front, smash open the door and charge into the inn. Hello, we're back. Um, just a little bit of technical issues um, with the yeah. cable being pulled out. But we're good. We're fine. Um, so going to read through what we just read through. Going to read through that again um, to give you the full breadth of what everyone is facing. Yeah. So as you make your way up the road, you spot a fiendish creatures hammering at the front door, at the inn's front door. Thick blaze of smoke rises from the roof of the nearby barn, which has been set ablaze. Voices can be heard inside the inn, shouting and cursing at the encroaching devils. As you, as you watch, the devils smash the door open and charge inside. And that's where I kind oh. of blacked out. Um, we're good. We, we're stable. We're not in yeah, the smoke. smoke. The we're smoke good. got to you. We're good. The it did. The smoke it got did, to you. Yeah. It made you pass out in your back. You're all good. Very yeah. good. So let's uncover the map. Let's get rid of the description. Oh. Move that away. Hide it, hide. There we go. And I can move it to about there. Cool. Huh. So, um, I think that might be an initiative. Okay. Seems to be. Um, because there's a couple of things happening. Um, there is a barn to the north. <laughs> I love that comment. Are you sure the party are not the fiendish creatures? I, I, I know. I, I, it's... I love that. Kind I, of I wouldn't mind up. doing a reverse descent into Avernus and escape from Avernus, maybe, or a descent into um, Baldur's Gate. Um, Do you descent or ascent? Well, just complications. Have... One of them. <laughs> oh. um, who knows? Um, so oh, again, Baldur's the... Gate is a horrible, horrible place. It is. Oh. Um, All right. So initiative. So we have our initiatives. Oh, bloody hell! Oh wow! For That's some two. Reason, I don't have a map. Nice. You don't have a map. What's 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 your dex, MLP? Uh, dex is five. I'm refreshing. Plus here. five. No, sorry. Uh, yeah, it's sorry, all. So I'm looking at my saving throw. Dex is three. That's because okay. you don't have sight. Uh, no, 16, you have sight. Are you sixteen or seventeen? Oh, there we go. Um, all right. Four, uh, on dex seventeen. So I'm three. Okay, you go. F you go first then, because I'm right. sixteen. Um, the way I, way, way I usually do it is you can go in any order at any time. You can keep on swapping it because you're pretty much the same. Okay. But if it's one of my monsters, I go first because I'm evil. Considering the shirt, yes. Oh, yes. Eh. Well, he, he <laughs> nice. didn't win, but we'll try for 2024. He came in second. Cool. Well, we're still waiting for votes, for vote mm. counting. Oh, right, okay. So you can probably see a oh, few dice there's rolling. There's a lot of uh, rolling there. Oh, interesting. 
much. Oh, fascinating, fascinating. Oh, it's fucking Lemmerays. That looks Let's like we're putting them all the Let's this down. Oh. And then order it. So. Uh, shall we? Where Yellow. is there an open door? Or, th- or Theron. There is an open door. I will open that for you because it is technically open because they smashed it open and charged in. There is f- there is smoke coming from the barn to the north. But there's shouts on the inside of the tavern. Actually, no, that's the wrong door. We'll close that door and put the other one open. That's fitting. I will turn to the elf. Ladies first. Oh, those are fighting words. No, after you, dear sir. <laughs> All of you insist. <laughs> I'll walk in. <laughs> I, I was so close to, use, to, to moving to them. Dropping down initiative. Mm-hmm. Ah, I see one. Um, Hunter's Mark on that one. That one? Yep. And I will pull my short bow and fire at it. Pull your short bow and fire. And 24 11. is a hit uh, for 11, 11 points of damage. Here we go. As this oh. grotesque, disgusting creature. Um, let's, let's do the, here's a picture, shall we? Yeah. That's what a uh, lamb ray. <clears throat> uh, um, there appear to be melted people inside. Mm, they, they probably I, don't have I any sh- money on them. I shot one. Yeah. It doesn't seem to react to it. It don't, certainly I, takes damage, but I it doesn't seem... Don't, I don't think they're... Best just kill him. <laughs> All right, if we must. I also need to put something else in here. Oh, Oops, hmm. cancel. Nope, don't do that. You may. No, 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 it was me. Like, I almost removed everyone's turn order. Let's get back into that. Okay. I'll so, it's your go. Yeah, and go, oh, that ain't good. Is that a window or a door here? That's the door that they smashed open. Okay. Well, I will say, I'll walk down and go, that ain't good. And drag my, um, my longbow out and do a shot on this one here. Do a shot. Do a shot. Or a 13. 13 hits. Four. Oh, that's right. Doesn't actually roll my damage. Um, you that's your character sheet. Where it says longbow on yeah, the that's chat. That's where I clicked. Oh, that's right. On the chat down there, it'll do it. I'll set up your character okay. as well. The auto roll damage now. Okay, cool. So you click on longbow on the chat on the side. That's right. And that'll roll it for you. Ta-da! Two five. points. Five points of damage. Um, and that's this one, because that's the one. No. Yeah. This one. Yeah. So this one, that's the one you can see. Yeah. Um, for five points of damage. There we go. Um, anything else? Any other actions? Uh, nothing else I can do, unfortunately. So it's okay. it is the, the Mary, the melty person's turn. Yeah, Wait, which one? Oh, it's the one you shot. Ah. So it's going to come out and attack you. Uh, is this the best way of having friends? How fast are they? Um. Let's see, enough to get there, just. Um, actually, no, they're not. Yeah. That's really annoying. I know. I thought... That's really annoying. 15 movement. I know. Oh, that sucks. Yeah. So Too he... bad, blobs. Um, so he moves to here and to here. All right, yeah. 
One, two, three. and you hear banging on something. Hey. Um. Let's go through. Um. So you also hear more banging. Banging. Huh? Yep. Back to our roguish. Oh, sorry, our wizard. Uh, yeah, no rogue this time. This time, red wizard. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to do what the red wizard does, and I'm going to cast sleep. Uh, so let's see. The range is 90 feet, so I'm just going to stay right here. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stay back from it all. Every, every creature within 20 feet of this point right here is going to get this uh, get this spell. Are you ready? Well, bam! If they have less than 20, 20 hit points or less, they fall asleep. Oh, is points. it less than 20 hit points or less, or is it calculated up? It's calculated uh, up, so 20 yeah. hit points of creatures total can be affected. That's what I thought. The lowest oh, gets affected first. Oh, bullshit! I, was, I, was, I thought I was going to put them all to sleep! The lowest gets affected first. Uh, sorry, I read um, my book wrong. I you, thought we were going to get out of here. Yella, can I hear a perception? Um, uh, perception, perception check. Uh, a perception check, yep. And Theron as well with disadvantage. Alright. Perception Yoni. Okay. Um, a 15 is enough for, um, for both. As you hear, um, they're attacking us for, with magic somehow. I'm right. That's right. Red From magic. Sound, but that's in common. That's not from... Oh, you... Collateral damage. Yeah. So, what have we got? Nine. I'm not, gonna, I'm not gonna lose sleep over it. You didn't put as many people to sleep as you thought, so yeah, you didn't how could you? How could you have known? How could you have known? That's right, Fine. that's right. I'm not yep. gonna lose sleep, but they okay. are gonna... Um, the one that um, Theron shot collapses. Um, I will have to check though, just in case that they're immune to it. Nope, they're not good. Nice. See, so, only one drops me. that you can see. Um, any movement? Uh, yeah, I guess I'll move a little closer. So does the diagonals work the same way as Pathfinder? No, you can, diagonals are just five. Really? Yeah. All right. Yeah. I can, I can yeah. go buck wild here, huh? Five, ten. Charge that thing. <laughs> 20, 25, 30. Oh, yeah, look at that. Oh, the wizard's a little too close, but hey, that's all right. I'm a tank wizard. Until you get hit. Yeah, right, until you get hit once, and then I'm done. With my eight sweet hit points. Till you get hit. God, I'm an idiot. All right. Thank you. Hey, bring it on, buddy. Bring it on, uh, as it, sh as it shambles out, um, <laughs> and it's just... It's not really a thing. It's like not really human, but it's not really like it's just mounds of flesh that's just moving, and you see like it move out of like arms stretch out, and then those arms have claws and spikes at the end, and its mouth is just like it's just it's it forms as it gets closer to you, and it hits, I, I believe, like with a seventeen. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Right. I mean. That's higher than 12. Really? <laughs> One point of damage. Hey, oh. all right. <laughs> Bam. Wow, that sucks. Yeah, that's um, too bad. Too bad. So if someone's asleep, do they get a save afterwards to get back, or is it just sleep, sleep? Uh, they, it's, it's one minute. Okay, he's down for one minute. Cool. Um, says that one down. That one's moved. This one's down, though we need to do this one. Oh, look at you that sleep. banging from the inside. Um, what's that? I'm going to hit this guy with my stick next time. Okay, so that's the... Oh no, I just thought of something. What? 
fire in barn. Yes, there's a fire whiskey in the barn. In, whiskey in barn. And the fire in barn is now moved to one. Accelerant. Okay, Theron, it's your go. Uh, I already hear that I have to do this, but I'm going to drop my bow. I'm going to draw my short sword. In, and I'm going to stab the one that's uh, fighting Romane. Uh, do, 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 do. That's a natural 20. Ooh, yeah. You are just welcome in this game. This guy's <laughs> not welcome. <laughs> 24 yeah. points of damage. I I'm tempted Holy using crap. the D4 to drop 24? that off over we're, we're, we're level one creatures. You're level Sneak. one. Sneak. I rolled amazingly well. I rolled two sixes, yeah. a five, and a four ah. on 4D6. Wow, that yeah. guy's gone. Bye-bye. So the flesh explodes everywhere oh. and just starts, uh, and it, it's, it hits you. This ain't worth it. Before it just, it just hits you and covers you, and then it starts disappearing. I don't know yet you still have that, that smell and that stench, oh. and it still feels like it's on your body, even though it clears up and dissipates. That's, yeah, I don't <laughs> know that I don't know. This this is worthwhile. Why are we going in here again? That's rough. That's because we want alcohol. I, I don't know if I want it that bad. I mean, it's going to be full of this goo. Um, any other any other movement or? No, that's going to end my turn. Okay, that's done then. Um, yellow. Uh, yellow. Visibly tries not to. Swallows down to vomit. And just says, uh, fine. Uh, I want to bomb no, not like that. So I will Is that that's the door there, isn't it? So yeah. Where um, uh, can I get a Can I get a um perception check? Okay, yeah, perception. Okay. Um you 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 hear something inside through all like you hear voice a voice inside um but you can't hear what's being said from all the banging um and thuds that are happening and you can see from your from um so um Ramelli and Theron can see that these creatures are banging on a door and banging on walls yeah, i think um, there may be people in there yeah Oh, we need more people for the caravan anyway, so... Toodly pip! <laughs> Toodly pip indeed! And... I guess that's our war cry now. <laughs> the Toodly pips! Toodly pip! I love it. Um, so 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. I will go inside and park myself here and regret my life choices. <laughs> oh dear, we have one, two, oh crap. I regret my life choices <laughs> more than I was normal. waiting for that. And see, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh great, we have six of them in here. We are so, so screwed. I will take out my... Uh, again, my longbow and shoot the one. Actually, no, shoot the one to the south. To the south. Yep. The one who's knocked out. Because that looks. Actually, that's the one that's knocked out. Yeah. So is that if I range attack on a down opponent, is that disadvantage to me or is that advantage? Yes. Okay, I will shoot the one next to it. Because they're technically prone, which means they're harder to hit somehow. I, I have don't no know. No idea how that works. Yeah. yeah. You think they're down, they're not moving, you can just take time. Yeah, I know. Work. It's just, it's the rule simplification making things unrealistically bad. Yeah. So take yeah. the one that's up, yeah. do your attack. All right. So that's Come on, let's, let's get this fast. Let's, let's speed up the combat. Let's get the danger happening. 14. 14 for 11. Uh, 14 is a hit for 11 points of damage. It's still somehow 
the creature, like, even though most of it is now stuck to the wall and it's ripped itself off. Yeah. And so, ha- like, more than half of it is on the wall. It's still functioning. Mm-hmm. Um, that's most of my movement. And, and the my smell turn. is starting to get to you. Uh, uh, uh. Um, so, yeah. that's yours. That's my turn, and I'm now the target, so hooray! Nice. Look to the north. Oh, swear words go here. Yep. Um, <laughs> and that's that. Now we go through the whole sequence of everything. Yep. Oh, boy. Okay, Harry, are they all going to run towards me? That one is. All right, um, 14 armor class. Um, 15 <laughs> movement. Can't reach you. Oh, yeah. I'm about to do something crazy. That's good. Um, the one at the door, or one um, to the south, this one, um, that you've essentially, it's stuck to the wall and half of it's broken away. Um, the half... Like, the part that's stuck to the wall is actually still hitting on the wall. Eh, that's so gross. <laughs> the, the other part, the, the other part that's, that's moved away, it turns towards you, and it's, and it, like, one of its eyes is still left on that part, and it looks at you, and it's, like, almost snarls, and then it falls to the ground. But the other part oh. is still banging on the wall. That's too funny. I just want to be gross, really. Yeah, right, um, it worked. <laughs> so... You hear more banging, um, and now that you're inside, um, you hear someone call out. But you can hear it. Holly, you can't unless you can do a perception, please. All right. With disadvantage. Okay, so I click disadvantage. I go to perception, which is, of course, I know exactly where it is, but will you just let, will you just, like, tell me? Left hand side of the sheet on the skills. It's on your character oh. sheet. Okay. So there it is. Oh boy. Two. So that's why. That's why we have. Um... Da, 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 da. <laughs> oh no! Did you use something on me? No, no. That's that's what I was saying. It's like that's why we have the um, disadvantage because it could have been twenty-one if it was. Yeah. So that's with a bullshit. with a three, you still can't hear what's being called out from inside. Don't care. Don't care. Unless it's, go go. away, don't worry, we don't need you. Is it my turn? All right, Romani, okay. Blaster caster, we're going to go 5, 10. Oh, oh my goodness. Look at all these uh, (laughs) gross bodies. Um, So I'm going to cast Burning Hands. Should I just go? You know what? I'm I'm going to stand right next to him. That's going to be a spell slot. It's a spell slot. But it's a 15-foot cone. So I'm going to be able to torch all those guys. Yeah, right? So here we go. You can, as you go um, close and you like really close to them as well, you can see that the wall and the door there has taken a lot of damage. Like they, they've been banging yeah. on the wall and trying to get through the door, trying to get through the door. So press your button, do your spell damage. Time, time to finish this. Okay, so you shoot Flame. flames from your from your fingers, and it spreads out through. Uh, pretty much all of them there. It hits the wall. It goes through the the holes they've made in the wall. Goes through the holes they've made in the door as well. And you hear screams from inside. I am the great red, red wizard. I care nothing for collateral damage. Um. Okay, so that's <laughs> you can't save if you're unconscious. Oh no. That's it. oh no! I'll give a save just because of the there's the wall is still there. So I'll give a save with advantage because the wall is still there. See, everybody's gonna be fine. I don't know what we're doing, right. but um. So I'll give a save with advantage because they're covered by the wall, even though they can't actively do anything. I didn't kill them, Karsh. Did. Um. <laughs> um. Okay, so there's a saving throw. Um, there's damage. Uh, this is an even damage. And then there's another saving throw I need to do. Da, Didn't da, expect da, to be da, doing da. this, but well done. Burning hands. Yeah, hey, burning hands is awesome. Put them in my pocket like they're like they're guns. 
And that's a failed save. Okay, you hear screaming. Um, ah, music to my ears. Female screaming now as well. Not just male, but female screaming as hey. well. The other one, you Equal can't really tell if it's male or female, but there's also most certainly female screaming added to the mix. So sorry, ma'am. Um, but for the monsters, it does nothing. What the... F oh, you mean I just cooked those people for no, for no reason? Uh, yeah. What a waste. All right, I got to go take an hour nap. So Bye. Friendly fire is the friendliest and warmest of hugs. Hey, well. um, All right. Well, I'm going to pay for this anyway. That's your go. What can I say but yikes. <laughs> um, um, that one is not a because the on the upside, the one that's asleep wasn't woken up from it because it did nothing to it. Does, so that's one fire coming out of my how, how does how does a huge like I guess they just don't. It's like flame. These are like flamethrowers right here. And flame to things from the abyss. Do very little. Oh, that's right. That like like they're at home. They're like, oh, thanks. They're from, they're from that hell. feels nice. Yeah. Oh, from hell. Uh, if if Kash was an evil DM, he'd say, "Oh yeah, you just healed everybody up to max hit points." <laughs> um, but evil will come shortly. Well, um, I'm out of spell slots, so I'm I'm leaving. Can I move now? <laughs> no, you've you've moved in. You've done, <laughs> we've done. We've already started other turns. Um, <laughs> so this one oh, then God, moves to here. Move. I know it's it's hard to get used to if you're not used to it. Yeah, yeah. And this one moves up and tries to hit you. Everybody's gonna hit. Pretty much guaranteed. My for an eleven. This is uh, miss. So yeah, miss. I dodge. Yeah. I go like this. Um, although this one moves down and he's able to actually hit Yella because it was actually oh. in range. Yeah. Oh, so sorry. So sorry, traveling companion. Uh, 14. Meets, so it hits. Okay. So, for four points of damage. Ooh. As Ow. again, it as it, it, like, when it's moving towards you, it's more like a movement of, like, flesh and bits and pieces rolling on the ground, and then it forms up, and as it forms, it forms an arm which, which pounds you, or forms a limb which pounds you. Um... <laughs> And then, hey, look, fire in the barn just went up. Um, oh, and let's see, we've also got something else happening. Fire in the hole. I should have said that. That would have been a great line. Why didn't I use that? Because huh. you didn't do damage? <laughs> oh, right. Yeah. Because you like theatrics, my dear. Oh, yes. Well, I do love the theatre. Did that work? There we go. Um, and we'll leave that. So that happens as well. For those inside that could see. That. Um, oh. Yep. And oh. now can I have, at the start of the round, everybody uh -oh. do a perception with... Um, disadvantage because again there's banging okay. and there's also screaming that's added to that uh five for some okay. reason we keep hearing banging and screaming and we're, we were like ah yeah i don't know so, what it is it's nothing forget it so yellow you hear um that first they burn, burn the barn with my husband now they're try, trying to burn the the tavern we, we need to get out of here to save our, my husband from the female voice. Oh, the husband's in the barn. Because the of course they're out. Of course. Of course. And that's what you haven't been hearing for the last few minutes. Or well, last couple of rounds, I should say. Well, sorry, I've got a lawnmower at the front. Yep. So fire in the barn is now at two. That's a counter. Theron doesn't know that. Baron sees things to stab. He steps in and down. I am first going to draw my short sword and strike at the one in the corner. 
This one still has your hunter's mark and he's I done. know I am I am aware. I am aware. Just bear with me. First this <laughs> one. 17 for 12 points of damage. Um yes, actually. I, I will then draw my offhand dagger and turn to the one on the ground and go Oh, this is disgusting and I will stab. Uh, which is because they are unconscious is an auto crit. Oh. This one gets hunter's mark. For yep. a fourteen. Yeah, that's a hit. That's uh thirteen points of damage. Yeah, the reason why it went down is because it had very little hit points. Yeah. Because of the hunter's mark. Yes. And that'll be my turn. Mm -hmm. Yellow. And one more finally gone. I, I yell out, um, husband in the barn. Um, what? Whose husband? The one you've been cares. burning. Oh, well, he's gone. I'm sorry. You've been burning people. Ah, I just you you again. see. Apparently. Again. You see the. Apparently, I know. All your, that you're facing like is all blackened and now uh, just smoldering. I mean, and you see holes through it and you see. You can mm. just barely see people. Figures there. Which oh, are like, you! <laughs> I gotta register these hands as deadly weapons. Uh, uh, that's unfortunately what we call acceptable loss. Yeah. Yeah. I'll try something different next time. Don't worry. Oh, that you think. Collateral you damage. Is the yeah. Terrible, is terrible the shame, but try and avoid it if you can. It's not you don't know. I am going to check because I've... Are um, you running? I'm, going, I'm running. I'm going to go out the door so they get two attacks of opportunity, correct? Yep. That's what I was hoping. Yep. That's what he was hoping. Yeah. Jeez. Um, one, two. Does a 14 hit? 14 hits. Does a 12 hit? 12 does not hit. By how much? Uh, by two. So you have to have to ask me to roll. There's the, the D four. Thank you for the donation. It hits. <laughs> uh, with a three on the on the roll. <sighs> so we'll take off the chat dice. Thank you for the donation of the chat dice. Um, mm -hmm. And it's gone for a good place because both those hit now. <clears throat> um, four. Oh my! Really? One point of bludgeoning damage, and two points of bludgeoning damage. Ah, they're good for that. So that's three, so I'm down to eight. This is why I didn't give you level two. Because they don't do much damage. That's yeah. fair. If they hit. <laughs> okay. Does that stop me in my action since I hit? No. Okay, then. You just take damage. Yep. That's five. So ten. And I'll see how far I can travel. So I can travel to about here. Yeah. What, right next to the other door? Uh, I've noticed this. <laughs> Sorry. It's a little bit of meta game there. 35, I can get to about there. Where's. You're where's not doing going? double move? Where, where are you going? Oh, I can do that, yes. 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 Action. You can use your action to. Oh. Running out of the battle. Yeah, oh, I, I yelled yeah. out there's someone in the barn. Okay. I'll take the word for it. So it has been in the barn, then it says it went to that thing. So I'm running. Check the barn. Uh, okay. I do. So it is now the one which was right above you. Um. It tries to chase its prey. Tries. Nice. Yeah. It's well, there's there's that. there's doing and there's trying, and this is most certainly going to be trying. Mm. Um, as it um hits the door from the from this side and goes through it. I have the perfect spell for these people. There you go. So it hits the door from this from the inside, mm -hmm. and it flings open. And then starts moving out, shambling, 
and as it goes over the it goes over the porch um okay but as it goes over the the start and go over the dirt the dirt also gets accumulated into its flesh and bits and pieces i'm tempted to give it extra damage um just because it has stones in it now please don't but i won't yeah. um because all these should be because they came from the outside some of them don't um okay so we've got 15. this one's going to come down t- and hit polly um actually we'll do it that way because that's flanking oh yeah so, oh wait a minute they have no brain these these guys are like yeah flanking. it'll be all right it'll be all right exactly that um oh really a nine and a oh one. so sorry <laughs> so, so not my wizardly ways tricked you that's okay there's more you know I'm the red wizard. Um, that one's gone. Can't hit me. Move that from order. That one's still here. Um, this one breaks in and starts attacking. Um, um, I'll say a thirteen is a hit. That it is. No, not, not on you. Oh. Not on you. Oh. Oh, now there they go. There they go. They finally made it through. Um, Umali, oh. it's your go. Okay. Your, your real victims are over that way. Go that way. I point toward, toward where they're going, down the other people. I don't want them to hurt me. But I am going to cast ray of frost which does two things apparently i just learned it it uh it does damage but it also slows them by 10 feet so these guys are not going anywhere <laughs> um here we go slots left no oh, no this is just a cantrip cantrip yeah. okay. so cantrip. i'm gonna i'm gonna yeah. shoot this guy right here oh wait well, i'm gonna shoot this guy right here uh unfortunately because you're in five feet of disadvantage five eight what? Yeah. Because what? you're a ranged, ranged attack in melee reach. But this is a this is the this is the spell. I go. Yeah. So um, in other hand, systems, like, in other systems, um, I would get attack of opportunities if you cast a spell. So. Oh, that's true. <laughs> it's got the manipulate trait. You're right. Because even mm. two e. Okay. Yeah. So, so all right, I'm gonna I'm gonna back off and take it. Take take it. Oh shit! I'm gonna take two attacks of opportunity. Yeah. Right. With advantage. Right? Oh well, I got myself in this mess, so I'm gonna I'm gonna move this way, and I'm just gonna take. So you it. can right, do it. you can do choose it. to disengage, which but that takes your okay, spell. Okay, how do I do that? But that takes That's your action, action yeah. and you can't cast your spell. Which one would you like? This you can. I want to cast my spell. Which means you take two attacks of opportunity spell. with advantage. Yeah, it's fine. So we're fine. fine. It's great. There I we love go. It. One, two. Come at me, bro. You don't want oh, this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was double critical. So that's um, a donation in chat, nice. which I have to do. Twenty twenty, yeah, yeah. Uh, hey, all right. It's double kind of dirty, critical. but yeah. Um, so we have five points and four points of damage to the character who only had eight seven health. Sorry, I have total max. eight, so I'm out. Um, so you are down have unconscious. Nice why didn't I just cast the spell? Why did I have to move? Fortunately, you can't see the blood amongst the red, red, uh, yeah, red. That's outfit. right. I, I look fabulous on the floor. Well, don't know about that. It's just the blood kind of, it's less emotional. I look fabulous. Again, less emotional. Um, so that's your go. Um, luckily, at the end of your turn, you get to roll yeah. a death save. Alright. Is it the, is it the start? The start. Start? Okay. So you don't have to roll a death save, which is actually a good thing. Mm. Um, maybe? Mm. Um, That's fine. So fine. that one's gone. Remove him from I'm, Colonel. I'm resting. This one. Um, there's a target, and there's not a target. Um, I'll give it 50 50. Um, as in 50, it's going to be Theron, or 50, it's going to be human. 
Um, high is there and high, yep. Then move to third in this one here. And try to attack. Oh, bollocks. Uh oh. Um, for a, a six, he's not going to hit. No. No way. Um, and then we got to go through the, the bits and pieces. Click. Um, they're trying to gang up. Jeez. Right, that's... So, this one stays there. This one comes down and moves in. And tries to attack. And fist. These creatures do a lot of damage. They don't, just they, yeah. Well, I guess. Two criticals does a lot of damage. Yeah. <laughs> um, one point of damage. So they're hitting on the people inside. And now, number one finally moves down for Theron. Number one. Actually, see, we had a discussion about having like danger in games and like hitting people when they're down and getting like the two death saves. I Should I? I? <laughs> you have to go are these the creatures? Are these creatures? <laughs> no. What would these creatures do? Are they smart or are they not? Just, not that smart. Are they vicious? Or are they worse? not that vicious? I won't. I'll just do it as. But it's coming at you. Is the alternative? I mean, I don't care. Okay. Um, I'd be happy to roll some saves. So that's a miss for um, Theron. And then the fire in the barn is going to three. <laughs> um, it's Theron or the others go. I look around, surrounded, my red friend, unconscious of the ground. I, uh, well, this is a fine pickle. And I will peace out and vanish. And I will cast Misty <sighs> Step. Yeah. <laughs> well, it looks like I'm out. <laughs> nice. No, can, can you just imagine that's in character line? Go. <laughs> it's, 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 I mean, it, it's the gif of that of that of that boy who just like and then fades into the background. It's like. <laughs> and uh, let's see, where do I want to go? Well, the other thing um, is the Homer, the Homer joke is fades into the bush. Oh, I'm going to. Path too. I'm not going to go far. I'm going to go here. Okay. You um, your bow. I did, but it's outside. Mm -hmm. Um. No, because yeah, no. I'm I'm going to go here, and I'm going to stab this one. I, I just love that your misty step. Um. He's just moving around to the other side of the combat because if you did it normally, there would be multiple attacks of opportunity. Exactly, yeah. yeah. Which is what downed your friend. <laughs> exactly, yeah. So, comrade, you. we don't know if they're friends yet. Um, uh, short friends sword. of opportunity. And I don't have sneak attack or hunter's mark on this one. No. So, boom. That's not advantage either, so it's just the left value. 23. That's going to hit. 7 piercing. Um, most, like, you cut down through it, most of it falls away, but there's still enough sentient f flesh moving about. Sentient flesh, jeez. And I'm going to, I'm going to take the attack of opportunity and go backwards one, jump on the table, and then jump, uh... Down here. Okay. Let's do an attack of opportunity. Actually, 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 no. I'm gonna go. Where was I? I was here. I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six. There. Okay. Um, attack of opportunity misses, so you, no problem with all that, and you get it out of there. I'm just gonna be like. <gasps> um, That's yellow. a problem. <laughs> <laughs> Out meanwhile, outside, Yella, you're being chased down quite slowly by something. <laughs> <laughs> the smoke is increasing, and you can 
you can oh, by now you can see yeah. there's fire everywhere. Yeah. Um, inside, and you can see the amount of smoke inside as well. Yeah, I did check. I do have just enough to get to here for 35 movement. From where I was. Mm -hmm. And I opened the doors to go look inside. Okay, open Is the door. Is probably a bad thing? I should have remembered back draft. Let's check about opening the doors, see if they're locked. Because that's a thing. Owning barn. Um... The doors actually open. Oh. Open from this side. Open the yeah. barn. Swing open the barn doors. And you are confronted with fog. With thick fog. Or sorry, thick th smoke. Uh, no, Dark Vision doesn't make it for that. No, it doesn't. So I yell and you can, while you can't see the fire, you can feel the amount of fire in here. Oh. Like the fire is hard to see, but you know it's in here, and yeah. just because the fog, and the, sorry, the smoke is so thick. I yell you, out you inside. You can see ladder up here though. Yeah. I yell inside. Is anyone need any help? Here's if you get a voice. If not, no I'll answer. run towards the ladder and climb it. Use my action to climb the ladder. Okay. And how much more movement have you got? Um, I can do. Would opening the door be an action or bonus action? I'll allow it as a bonus. If that, that's the case, then I've got, I'll do a dash and I'll dash up the ladder. Yeah. No um, So move to where you need to be. Let's stop the ladder for you. Yeah. And do I... Oh, so there's lower and upper ground, is that right? Well, yes, you're now upper ground. Yeah. And I... Okay. How much is that? There's five feet. So how many movement? You think another ten feet? So we've got thirty-five. That's um, I think um, you might have. I would say another five or maybe ten. If if you want to do ten, uh, so if you want to do um, an athletics, I'll let you do an athletics or an acrobatics to clamber up the ladder easily and get an extra movement from that. All right, I'll do an acrobatics. Um, and that passes the 15 I was thinking. So you clamber up, and I'll give you an extra 10 movement. Now that you're up top. And I'll get to about there. Okay. So you can see, like, you can see the fires now. Um, there's fires here, here, and here. And next round, you can spend your time looking to try to see anyone in nearby or any yep. individuals. But that'll be next round when the yep. fire goes to... Oh. Yep. Back in the in the tavern. Actually, not back in the tavern because we had someone chasing you. <laughs> Quite slowly. Quite slowly, yes. <laughs> it may take a long while. <laughs> so that one. Back yeah, in like, the tavern. <clears throat> I did the absolutely stupidest thing. Like, why would you run up to somebody that you can easily stay away from? True. I did a great job. That's what I did. Terrific. It reminds me what happened in the first game with this one. Like, my character got down as well. Shit. Yep. And... I just thought it'd be you hear a burn. scream of a female voice from inside and the scream is cut short. Oh no, I'm over it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> A um, Polly, can you please roll a death save? I sure can. What do I got to do? Is it a d20? Um, Straight d20. Straight on your Straight character d20. sheet. We'll do it properly. On your character sheet, okay, there is a button right. called properly. death saves. Um, yes. Click on that. It is a straight d20 roll. Oh, Hi. yeah. Ooh. I cast nuclear bomb. <laughs> I have it somewhere. Let me click it. No fucking Wait, way. What? Yeah. I'm alive! I'm yeah, alive! I don't know what that con means, though. Conscience at one hit point at the start of your turn. Right! Alright, alright! Room! No, no, you are right. lying it's down. Gonna, of your it's turn. gonna be fine. It's gonna you're be pr fine. You're, you're prone, but. I can still cast a spell. I'm gonna yeah. go down again, I guess, but. That's fine. 
It's Look great. This. this is sweet. So what do you want to do? Okay, so it's my turn now. I am going to cast Ray That was at the start of the turn. What do you... You are prone. There's creatures above you. If they yep. attack you, they have... Yeah. You can stand up from prone using half your movement. Yeah. Okay, so I'll stand up from prone. Yep. And now I'm going to cast Ray of Frost. Oh, wait, but, it, but it's a tra- is there a trigger on attack of opportunity? No. Okay. But you, so have, gonna... but you, have, disadva- but you have disadvantage. And it's That's fine. the penalty for being That's, in yeah. close range. All right. I'm, I'm, I'm going to freeze this guy right here. I'm going to try. Or, yeah, I'm going to try to freeze him. Here we go. Here we go. Oops, hold on. I got to click disadvantage. I'm sorry. I messed up. Let's do that again. If you just roll, roll it again and you'll do the next one. We'll take okay. whichever one is lower. All right. But the first damage. No, oh, you only say that because I did one point of fucking damage. Well, it what does hit. Oh, wait, no, it doesn't hit because of the disadvantage. Wait. Ten, no? Does ten hit? That hits. Yes. Yep, that hits for one point of freezing damage. Yeah, these guys that's fucking what... suck. That's, <laughs> that's terrible. I just, checked, I just checked their AC for the first time. Yeah. 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 All right, well, uh, all right, so I'm, I'm going to try to get out of here. Oh. Uh, hmm? Yep. Uh, yeah, as, as, can, as the uh, ice, as the ice hits them, yeah, 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 he freezes. Um, as the ice hits them, it doesn't freeze them, but it seems to hit their, it seems to hit their flesh, and just shatter and flake off quickly. Ah, oh, these fucking guys here already. They did right, some out. damage. They're just resistant. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so like one point of damage. They're resistant, so... Yeah, so I, they still take the one point of damage. Oh, all right. But, you round yeah. up. Yeah. All right, okay. Well, I'm out. Uh, so I'm going to try to be cool like my friend there and say, peace out, and I'm going to walk away. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> like, yeah. How did that happen? You said it, so let's do it. I use half my movement. He's going to miss anyway. See, look. Uh-oh. That wasn't a miss. Yeah, all I have to do is one damage. I know, but as no. both of them hit you. Hey, that's oh. not. Good. That's not. That's oh, not you know fair. what that means? <laughs> yeah, but oh I'm a little no! Now. What does that mean? Oh no! The, the, the first second one takes one, you out. Yeah. Oh, the second one automatically gives you two wounds. Oh no! Two failed. Two failed. Death two failed death saves. saves. You only get three failed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's very well, rare to roll 20 to get out of that on the first roll. So, you're on the verge gonna... of death. Ah, yeah. ah. Someone please donate and give me a d4 so I can just alter that death. So, I'm just I'm not kidding. I'm good. Uh, Neuro, don't. Nah. <laughs> I walk away, <laughs> stab Romani. <laughs> yeah, right. Boom. Okay, so. Um, so, uh, wait. I have like a. Ha- like, like like a fifty percent chance of dying, right? Next turn. Yes, on your next turn. Nice, perfect. Correct. Yeah, and, and for quite a while. Yeah. Um, <laughs> All right. Yeah. So well, I'll sit pretty till then. Um, it's the one that actually hits you and knocks you down. It's his go, but they're not sentient. They're not smart enough to do that. But the, so they're going to go over your body <laughs> towards yeah. Theron. And then that, that's a charge, charge. That's oh, double they dashed. Yeah. They dashed, yeah. Um, dash, I charge, dash, I keep on, yes. And inside the room, the blood fest didn't continue this round. Which is surprising. I'm shocked. I got um, overconfident because they kept missing me at first. This one can move 15. No, he can't because he needs to... I'm going to do an acrobatics roll with disadvantages as they try to move through the table. But I froze them. Did. That reduces their speed by 10 feet. Yeah, they can't go. Well, I, I, I just <laughs> only one totally of them. right. That's yeah. the exact one. No, that's the exact one he did. Yeah. He, he starts yeah. moving and just... Yeah. <sighs> Nice. Um, fire in the barn turns to four. Hey, I don't even know what that means. 
Theron. Romani, like stop going down! I can't use my sneak attack. <sighs> oh dear. This will have history. to do. I will bonus action pass my hunter's mark onto this one, and I will stab it with my short sword. That's not advantage. That's just a ten. But a ten is a hit. Seven points of damage. As as it kind of moves into the 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 blade as you're swinging, damage doesn't matter. It's only on one. Um, again, the the explosion of bits and ichor uh, goes over your body. The smell wafts over you, and then what was on you just dissipates and disappears. And I'm going to, to and I'm going to start running circles around them. So, <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. Um, well, my turn. And back at, to the barn. And at my turn, I will get close to the edge here, and I will do a perception check to see if I can find anybody. Okay, you here? Oh, I will. We'll do the perception check, and we'll see. What goes now? I'll give you some descriptions of what's going on. So, there we go. Um, so you you can't see at the moment because there's so much smoke and it's coming up into your eyes. You think there's fire really close to you, underneath you, which is why it's killing your eyes so badly. Um, yeah. You can hear um, horses in here. Um, Horses which could have been doing a lot of damage to you if you went down the bottom route oh. instead. Nice work going up the ladder. Um, but other than that, um, you think the fire, you can, you, the heat is increasing, you think the fire is increasing, and you think that the um, the DC for that roll might also increase um, each round. Because the smoke's getting thicker. So, uh, hmm. that's yours. Then I know who's next after you is. Is old mate Lemire. You see at the door the Lemire, and then it starts, then it disappears as it moves into the smoke. Ah. I have climbed the ladder. It's secret. It's like a Dalek. It can't get upstairs. Mm hmm. You know, also might just attack the horses. Um, oh, that might work. Back in the tavern. Back in the tavern yeah. at 15. The Lemire that actually you ran away from starts shambling around. Again. Can reach you. Can't do uh -huh. damage. Come at me, you towering mound of corrupted slime! Um, by your vantage point, you can see inside the, the what looks to be what um, a back building or storeroom um, as the creatures are pummeling into... Um, well, pummeling, pummeled into I one blooded mess. I, I can't see, that's the thing. You can't see at all? No, that's completely well, black. Inside here, you can see through the walls and through the holes of the walls that there's a blooded mess of what was a person. Further in, there's another person who is close to that state. Mm -hmm. And there's two Lemires in there. Um, so that's happening. That's those two. Alright, it's my turn! It's your turn. Let's get okay, a here death we go. save or die. Ten, ten or higher. Ten or right. higher. Ten Ready or folks? higher or die. Here it comes. Oh, I'm still alive. Now you have to do that several more times. So do I die if I if I fail any of the any of the any of them? Nice, nice. Okay, all right, good. Any of them. I continue um, to rest a little bit. I That's will point out that there is, there was a, because um, this is Eventually's content and we're doing pseudo Eventually's stuff, there is a Eventually um, rule where you can elect to make those death saves harder 
apparently, but earn more experience. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, and when I mean like this is when I mean hard, I think it's like fifteens. Um, yeah. This is this is great. <laughs> I always say I like when my character's at risk of death, so I'm never yeah. I've never had a better time. Okay, so this one's dead, uh, and this one is ooh. Let's see. Um, inside, um, inside this room here, um, so it's two now, the, whatever, whatever they're attacking is almost down, almost dead. Um, so yeah. And, um, we got one more. Oh, it's still, it can move only one because of, <laughs> how long, I don't know how long, how long does that last? Yeah, how long is it called? Let me freeze away. Might be one minute. Let round. me let you know. Uh, let's see. Yes, I told you not to buy one to kill off the character. That's, that's really, really mean. <laughs> we'll, we'll, let, we'll let the character die naturally. Because that's uh, absolutely going to happen. Die naturally in, in their own habitat. Yes. And its speed <laughs> is reduced by 10 feet until the start of my next turn. Okay, you've so it's, had it's, a turn. Yeah, it's moving yep. fast. So it moves. Um, That's weak. And stands there. Um, and the barn goes up by one. Theron, is your go. Hunter's mark on the fucker in front of me. Which one? Uh, this one. The one. That's what I thought. <laughs> And uh, uh, fucking short sword him. Mm hmm. I am kind of between a rock and a hard place. But! I'm not I even mean, putting Hunter's Mark on that character I because mean, it's already gone down. I mean, come on. What can I say? I'm a man of great talent. Can I get a fortitude save, please? Me? Oh. Yes. <laughs> Is that a constitution save? Yes, constitution save. I've Very so well. been playing Pathfinder. Well, I knew what you were talking about. I know. <laughs> as as this time when the when the explosion goes off, you you're starting your your. I mean, look at and it goes into your mouth this time. And even though it's in your mouth and it burns away, the taste stays. Oh, Harry, that Harry. is like some kind of that's the evil GMP revenge. Yeah. For all the all the alcohol not being drunk, drinkable in Saints and Sinners. Maybe a little um, <laughs> Oh so, God! Oh Romani, I wish I was you right now. This is horrible. <laughs> as the blood spreads out from the from the other side of the room, you still have movement. I do. Um, I'm going to run up here. Okay. I'm just, I'm just <laughs> leading this one on a chase backwards and forwards like a fucking Scooby Doo. Yeah, they had a held action. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. That's why you only moved fifteen. Did it hold held to dash or what? No, held to like if you come around to to, to hit you, or if you go oh, onto the okay. table. That was it. But no, you just killed the one next to you again with a critical, and yep, that's it. Back in the barn. I come here to shake things up. <laughs> yeah. What can um, you see in the barn? Well, I will do a perception check again. I hope. And fail. Can I have a fortitude? Constitution save, please. Thank you. Okay. The 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 smoke is present. It's not hampering you yet. Being no prolonged exposure um, will certainly start hampering you. Yep. Well, in that case, then I will say ah, goodbye, dear sir, and start and get to the ladder. Okay. You hear the screams of a horse. Ooh. Um. Mm. Can I attack the in the direction of the horse? See if I can attack what it was to attack the horse with disadvantage. 
Um, I'll give you a 50-50. I'll give you... Okay. I'll give you an attack roll, and I'll give you a 50-50. Um, so, I'll essentially... Roll the attack first. Roll the attack first. And you're shooting into the smoke. Yep. So, 17, no, gonna, you're going to hit something. Yep, okay. Um, high or low? Uh, I'll go low. Low. So... Low is, you don't hear a scream. Mm. Or reaction. High would be a neigh of a, and a yelp from a horse. Oh, okay. So we'll do it that way. Um, I've never... Do you want to roll it? Um, you can do the, no, the damage is there, six. Mm -hmm. No, I'm saying, you want me to do the roll the d4? Oh, you got a d4 as well. No, I'm saying, do you want to do the roll to see if, who I hit? No, I've done that. Okay. Yeah, I've done that. It's a, was it ended up jam roll. Don't worry about okay. that. But you hit so something. It. Okay. All right, and that's my turn. Okay. Um, and that's that's that go. Um, I will do a d8. I need to roll. Oops, that's a d6. Let's go to d8 instead. Um, okay, we'll take that anyway. Um, okay. So let's go back to... That's done. Not 15s. There's so many of these in here. That one's dead. With the Hunter's Mark. Um, that one is still... This person is hanging on inside. But not for much longer. That's it, finally. The last gasp of whoever was inside has now stopped. Um, Holly! Hooray! Whee! Can we have a death save, please? You sure can. 50-50 of surviving Boom. for one more round. <laughs> for one more round, I know. We've that's got a 5% so chance of coming back. Yes! Second success. Yeah. You know what? It couldn't happen to a better wizard. Well... That's Better. debatable, and a very short debate, which I think you'll lose. Oh no. Oh no. Oh yeah. Okay, in the, the storage room, you hear the sounds of feasting. Um, but here, we've got... That. Oh, would you just fuck off already? Again, he can't actually hit you with that movement. Find the barn turns to six. Seven. Ugh. I will move Hunter's Mark onto this one. Okay. But I will then go around here and I will uh, attempt to stabilize Romani with a medicine check. Oh, Unbelievable! God. Holy cow! I might live! Well. Mm, well, I had such a great line for when I died key, too. The key, the key word Fail. is attempt. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. Good. 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 Come good. on, Romani. I need you to help me with it's my sneak attack. Shh. <laughs> four. Nice. It's yeah. not a four. I'm gonna live on my own merit or die. Um, Fuck. That's your bonus action. That's your movement. Unless you want more. Is that more. my action? That was that your action. action. Yeah. Us. Well, I just die then, I suppose. And I'll turn back to face the thing. <laughs> <sighs> if you're not good enough to accept this, you're not my friend anymore. <clears throat> That's what you need to say. Back to Yellow. Yellow um, is... Would you like to do a perception? Yes, I would like to do a perception. Again, the smoke's I like to see increasing. 16? Okay. And um, let's move something onto the map layer, shall we? Right underneath where you were, you can just make out in one of the stores, there's an arm sticking out of the store, and there's like there's just like this break of the smoke. And there's an arm and there's a little bit of um like looks like a bits of a person, you don't really know for sure, like it's it's humanoid. 
But it's not like the flesh of the creature, but it's also really close to flame. Oh, joy. Fun. Fire okay. in the bomb is on six. Again, this is a timer. Yes, I'm just trying to think. <laughs> timer. What would you I like to do? I would like to try to rescue it, but... Yeah, no, nah, I'm out of there. Yeah, I also I also put the other creature in the... So you got just enough. Mm-hmm. He's there. Okay, well, I will then run. Mm-hmm. Run out. And then run out. Okay. Would you like an acrobatics to slide down the... The ladder quicker. Um, yes, I'll try the acrobatics. Yeah, this is acrobatics, not athletics this time. This one gets splinters. Yeah, all out. Okay. Yes. So, free movement so down the ladder. Yep, so free movement down the ladder. I see the... The... Lemur. Lemur, right. yeah. I mean, nope, out of there. Sorry, dear chum. Um, yeah. Good luck! And I will... Thirty... Use my action to dash to... Five, ten... Thirty-five to there. Okay. To the doorway. Where you can see... Theron um, taunting and facing off with more of them. You can't see just below, out of out of sight, yeah. the almost dead body. Um, the creature that was in the barn just keeps on attacking horses. You've given it something else to attack. Let's see what else we've got. Um, feasting. We're back to um, death saves, I believe. <laughs> oh, I just I just knocked my ears out. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's, that's, is that a good omen or is it a bad omen? Here we go. Probably bad. Oh, oh my god! Oh, really? Oh, come on. <laughs> yes. Asus. Relmani, the red Wait, wizard, rises right yeah. again. Yeah. Well, no, you're unconscious. You just don't. But dying. I'm alive. I'm alive. In order to kill me, you have to do three more. You... No. No, I don't. There's no, There's no wounded it. condition, right? So I'm back. That's true, but if I hit you once more, it goes down by two. Uh, well. Yeah. Uh, either way, um, we've got more feasting. That's that's your go. You're now unconscious. There's more feasting going on in the back room. Um, there is a creature that is marked on Theron and do that attack. Yeah. will hit yes it does and let's do the attack let's do the damage and one one but frustratingly i have to make a concentration check mm-hmm. Easy. no problem um so that's its go and at seven this is what happens Whoa, something's wrong. Okay, I'm sure it's fine. Yeah, I guess we're dead. As the barn collapses oh. in on, it, on itself. Oh no. Yeah, the count was That's there okay. for a reason. Yeah, no, the count was there for a reason. <laughs> oh, yeah, I was expecting maybe 10, ten count. Nope, seven. Well, yeah, I'm not in the barn, oh. so nobody no. was in the barn. <laughs> yeah. Oh no. Yeah, yeah, we're fine. Whatever. I did say um, sorry. So I can take that off. Yeah. Sorry, gotta go. Theron, back to you. You know what, you bastard, you are. I look at the single, like, little scratch I've got. It's like, ah, you're a rascal. And I will stab. <laughs> it's. Oh, come on. And I will I offhand. I will offhand dagger as well. But that's a natural one. Uh, may I flavor this? You can. Do a life. You're a rascal, and I stab, and then I pull out and try and go for the dagger, but I just fall into it. Just... <laughs> Does please tell me it explodes? 
No, it's still alive. I... <laughs> Yara, for God's sake, help! Yellow at the door. I'll get into. I'll move to there. There <sighs> are no bodies in the room except for Ramelli on the ground behind the table, and there's the flesh creature. One single flesh creature that you can see left. Oh. Although you can hear some unsettling sounds to the south. <laughs> unsettling. Feasting. Oh. Nice to have known them. Ew. Takes out the bow, does a, a shot to the one here. Do we attack? Combo. It's dead. Yes! Evil triumphs over good! <laughs> oh, um, it it starts moving closer to about there. Worse evil. <laughs> yeah. Right, I'm changing my alignment too. Um, Done. So, and does anyone want to go into the back room? Uh, we need to find the alcohol. hole. Yeah, no, I think they're, they're dead. They're long dead. This, yeah. uh, yikes. I'll, 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 it's kind I'll of far. I'll I'm a little that. tired. I'll change this again. Does anyone want to go into the storeroom? But we have to go there if we want to get alcohol. If we want alcohol, we have to look at very grisly dead bodies and kill two more of those things. Do I wake up yet? I'm fine. Oh. Um, I'll lead down and here. slap. Well, technically, no. Uh, no, no she's dead. I will avenge you, Ralmani. It took my favorite red wizard from me. Oh, you win some, you lose some. Come on, let's go. <laughs> All right, down to. Which reminds me of another red wizard, actually. Mm. Uh, there's there's another one. There is no other. Can I do a quick wizard. medicine check on her as I'm on Ramani as I'm walking by? Are we still on initiative? Or yeah. That? Well, that's why I was asking if you're going down there. Or if you're not, that's what I was asking. We're going. I'm going. We're going to go down there. We're here for Yeah, we're going. We're here for Yeah, alcohol. all right. So I'm going to take anything else, not those, out of initiative, uh, including Romali, because well, you are unconscious. So take well, thing. we'll leave you in initiative, but we're going to skip you. Boo. I know. Can no. I roll the wake up? No. Oh. Doesn't work like that. Uh, oh. If only we had a cleric. <laughs> okay, so yes, you're in initiative. So um, we'll we'll go to the start of initiative, which is Theron. Right. <clears throat> well, if you want to make an omelette, you've got to break some eggs. Here we go. Oh, the smell is awful. Oh, the smell is awful. I can't see them. I cannot. Okay, mm -hmm. so I'm going to open up the dynamic lighting. So, um, where am I? Just turning it off. Where's the door? Is the door here? Oh, the door is there. Oh, look. I'll take that ah, off too unless you can... Looks like there's some dead civilians. Yeah. Oh. So you should be able to see things now. Um, right. As the walls themselves, they've got enough holes in them. And um, the main entrance area is down here. I'm, going to, I'm, going, to go, I'm going to go here. I'm going to pass my hunter's mark onto this one. And I'm going to stab them through a hole in the wall. That that area there is enough to move through, which is the, what they've done. Okay, well I'm just gonna yeah. do your attack. Yes, Theron. The the inside of this room is a bloody covered mess. Eight. That's, that's damage. Wow. Um, and the the two individuals that were once here are just limbs. And organs. Um, I'm just like I'm just like. Mm. <laughs> uh, yellow. Um, can I get? Can I see? I mean, if I move to around here-ish, can I get any any shot inside? 
Okay. Um, I'll give you a, I'll give you a ranged with disadvantage as you're trying to shoot through the holes yep. of the wall, the burnt holes of the wall, which is how someone started this combat. <laughs> started yeah. knocking them. Well, all right. So uh, with disadvantage, longbow. Yeah, the the counter was also on how long the walls went. Um, yes, it's a hit, not the nine points so of damage. Oh, Which sorry, one? one, that one there. Yep. And uh, we'll, we'll just skip the rest because it's, you clean up, essentially. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I just wanted to know if you were going to put yourself in danger, really. No. But there's no real danger. I mean, I want. I, I need the alcohol. That's why we've come. If we came yeah. here and we don't get the alcohol, it's all for nothing. Mm-hmm. Pretty much. Uh, so clear of that, we'll, cut, we'll, we'll turn them back, back to normal. Um, Life and limb for a drink. Gods. So this is a dry tavern? What? No, I'm, kid- I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I, I stab myself. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Actually, are the taverns in Elterel dry taverns? Or the actual tavern taverns? No idea. No idea. No? You just wanted to get the reaction out of us. Yes. Yes, yes you did. Yeah. 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 There's your highlight moment too. for the night. Oh, by the way, there's a dry tavern. What? What? No, I think that the evil triumphs over the good was the clip mark. Um, <laughs> and and most of the things that Lorian said. Um, <laughs> um, can we, is Romani awake and unconscious enough? Um, eventually Romani will... Romani will awaken after you've looted everything. Of course. Let's loot. I, no I, loot, no, I, loot. I don't even get in on the loot. Of course I, I loot, don't do that. I loot Romani. <laughs> yeah, there's no honor. No, no, no honor um, among thieves. So you find people. in your looting, um, there there are this is a storeroom. So there's barrels, um, barrels of wine and, and booze and whatnot. And there's and you would assume there's also a basement of more as you start searching around, and there is a basement of more. There's also underneath where there's a basement. There's almost like a a a, a chasm in the floor. Which you just don't want to go near. Mm. Um, what I'll do... And there's footprints leading out of it. Like burned mark uh, footprints moving out of it. What I'll do... Somberly. Slowly. With great reverence. I will take a glass. I will take a second glass and I'll hand it to Yella. I will pour wine in each. I'll raise. To random woman A... <laughs> Random woman B, <laughs> and to our dear friend Romani, may their souls find peace in whatever afterlife the manic gods have concocted for us. Can we have done that? Done this after the looting? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Thanks. Right. Do you have a shovel? We need to bury her. <laughs> <laughs> Well, do uh, do we have the time for that? Uh, is the is the fires in here? In the no, that's right. She'll, it's it's fine. It'll be a cremata- cremation. That's, that's cremation. Fine. Cremation. She'll... Cremation. Well, there, um, there's, there's a chasm underneath <laughs> in this in the cellar. I know what. I know what. But there's an I impressive will, heat will, coming I up from pour, it. I will pour another glass of alcohol, and I will pour it over Romani's dead body. Speed <laughs> up the cremation process. I'm still alive. I'm not dead yet. With it, with a tear in my eye. I'm getting better. <laughs> Dear, feels like I barely knew her. My hand goes up and grabs his throat. <laughs> you fucking bastard! I'm still alive. Uh, yeah. uh, uh, zombie. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> um, looting. Yes. You find you find the cash box um, with um, nine gold, one silver, fifteen copper. That doesn't sound. Um, like you also find oh, it adds a lot for level ones. Yeah, you also oh, find a bottle. Um, on person of one of the meat blobs that was left. 
in the storeroom? A bottle of... Something? I, I uh, uncork and give it a sniff. It's something? It's not alcohol. I will... Um, do you have any wounds? I've lost one HP. You get one HP back with that little... Hey. Ah! Hey. Wait, what about give me? This, yeah. Give me <laughs> some money. Nice. This is good stuff. still alive? There's yes. one way to find out. Fair enough. Just reminding. Um, looks around, gets a funnel, puts it in the mouth and pours. <laughs> What's the end of fine? <laughs> the so, degradation. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, sorry. Um, let's see. Where's my roll? Um, oh, wait. Yeah, what happens? Do we know uh, what happens? Button. You're going to kill me again. It's a random. Totally. Button. I get five <laughs> points back. Oh Ooh. shit! Five hit points. I jump up. Hello, money. You dead, man. What's up? Hey, uh, I My am God. Romani Kamel, the Red Wizard. I'm back. I'm ready to go. My God, <laughs> that was a potion of resurrection. <laughs> you could have sold that for so much money. <laughs> sorry, so sorry. You Hello. couldn't have spent it on a better character, a better person. Mm. Me. I'm sure he'll make me plenty of money in the future. You are uh, forever in my debt. <laughs> and I think that's how we're going to wrap it up. Because um, yeah. these guys are going to keep on doing this for another hour. Um, so just what was the loot real quick? Um, coin, one, healing one potion. Gold. Nine gold of coin and one bottle of something plus alcohol. So nine, nine gold. gold, one silver and um, 15 copper. And a, a potion of healing, which you just used. Or yeah, well, potion of resurrection, if that's what you want to keep saying it is. Because, well, yeah, why not? Um, and you can, you can, essentially, you can have booze supplies. All the booze. You can carry, because anything else was in the barn for transporting booze. Including the horses. So, that's the catch. Mm. Uh, <laughs> that gets shown. <laughs> yes, it does. Oh boy, I have to do that, Terry. I'm I am in a saucy mood tonight. Really, I I I didn't I that didn't come across. Um, so thank you everyone to to put up with to put up with our um, saints and sinners, rogues and refugees. It's not a normal dark and no. moralistic game it's, it's pretty much the opposite it's yeah. nice to have this game as a venting game oh yeah exactly it has always been used as a venting game um marco uh Lauren. it's it's very much that yes so we'll do our outros um yep. Lauren, would you like to do who you are what and all the bits and sure. pieces i have been playing uh Theron, the uh, human rogue. Uh, catch me on uh, Twitter at Lorian Ross, uh, Facebook Lorian Ross. I'm on SoundCloud, Spotify as well. Uh, I have just opened commissions. So if you want some custom music uh, with full license to use it on Twitch and YouTube without any of that pesky copyright DMCA strikes getting in the way, uh, it's 50 quid per minute. Uh, I'm open. Uh, catch me on, uh, message me on Twitter and uh, we can organize something. Awesome. Um, Polly Peoples? Hello, hello. I'm Polly. And uh, yes, of Polly People, you can find me on Twitch at Polly People. You can also find me here on Goblin Cave TV every Monday playing A Guard's Tale. Today, I was Romani Camilled. Romani Camilled, the Red Wizard from the Red Village. And uh, <clears throat> I did and a great job sleeping most of the most of the scenario. And no one knows about the red wizards. Wow, I'm totally gonna actually start ad having to add content about red wizards for this, just for that character. Yeah, that's right. That's I right. hate having to do extra work. Thanks, Polly. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> just, just anyone out there, Google red wizard at D and D, and see what you get. Huh. 
By oh, the way, cool. did I mention that? Did I mention that Theron's in the Harpers? No, you didn't. Not that we have real Harpers in our games, but yes, I'm not putting that in. Just yeah. Um. So, and did you everything? Okay. I got it all. You got it all. Bye 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 bye. I've got to. I'm got to organize other things while we're doing this because we don't have a credits roll, which is stuff ah. I usually do in the credits roll. So, Mr. Live Producer. I'll try to pay this out. Hello, Mr. Live Producer. I mostly do VR content, uh, production work, and every Wednesday, Thursday, I'm here. Wednesday night, US. Thursday night, Thursday morning, Australian. I'm here playing either your multiple little characters, literally multiple characters. Um, you're, today, I've been playing your wood elf ranger, yellow paramenor, the English. I did beat. I did piss with last time. My legs are killing me. Um, I also include... doesn't affect your tongue. <laughs> um, I in uh, in Saints and Sinners, I play Burlock Ungar, your multi-class barbarian ranger. Gee, I wonder why you chose ranger here because does for the multi-class. And on uh, Smuggler's Run, I play your Yosoki mechanic spoke plug yeah, yeah i can remember something for a change and you can also catch me on twitch.tv slash mr producer fantastic thank you uh, enough time should yes. he should we also mention the change in schedule yes we are because saints and sinners is not going to be airing the normal unless you are you recording it or are you airing but we, we, we record everything anyway um yeah so saints and sinners um is not going to be on our normal time which would be this time next week next it's going to be moved to sunday night for the u.s um, Australia morning for uh, Australia. Monday morning. So Monday morning Australia. That's stuff words. Yep. Um, I didn't do VR. Well, I did, but yeah. Um, so that's going to be for next week. Um, it might be the the finale for the year or the end of the season, and we'll come back next year um, once we're a bit rested. And we've also tomorrow's TTRPG. I don't think it's going to be on. Um, I, I want to actually spend a bit more time on the next couple of projects, so they will be airing at some point soon, but probably not tomorrow. We are going to be raiding Crit Force 1, um, who it's the first time we've raided them, so um, share the love. Our, uh, sorry, our raid message is, we come to share the love, our hearts are warm and fresh, Goblin Hearts if you're a member of the channel, if you're not, don't worry about the Goblin Hearts. Thank you for everyone coming in, thank you Neurocock as always. Um, Thank you for not deliberately killing off the character. That's kind of mean. So could have happened easily, though. Um, so we're going to do the raid now because we don't have a um, credit also. Bye. Bye. Bye.